done. Thanks. Good luck. Is it dangerous? Oh, Burgos, thanks and good luck. Come on, mate. We're off to a bad start. It's a hundred leagues or more to Havana. Will you walk that distance? Gmail. Thanks for good luck. Off limits. Thanks for good luck. Posh git. Where's he running to? Follow and I'll kill you. We could work together on this. Schooner will do me just fine. Commodore! 
Gotta head to Kingston, where the commandeer this lover's ship follow. Sorry, uh, Kingston? No, no, our destination is... Lacking a rowboat, I'm afraid we'll have to swim to my ship. Hardly the worst thing to happen. Oh, oh, this bit is difficult. I should have taken the coat off. Aboard, Duncan. She's a modest schooner, but well suited to my purpose, trafficking cargo from my plantation and such. She'll do fine. There's a strong wind now. Let's strike to full, shall we? Ah, there's a tug of the wind at my hair. Ah, I find a bracing comfort in the feel and smell of the ocean. The raw stink of... of possibility. That's a top way of seeing it, mate. We've really opened it up now, haven't we? <laughs> Those sailors were quite animated by the idea of pirates roaming these waters. Is it a real danger, do you suppose? A possibility. But most pirates stalk the windward passage between Cuba and Hispaniola. Oh, I see. Yes. That is a bustling strait. But I shouldn't worry about being waylaid by pirates, truth be told. My ship is small, and I have nothing of immense value. Sugarcane and its yields, molasses, rum, that sort of thing. <laughs> There's not a pirate living who'd turn his back on a keg of rum. Well, yes. Yes, I suppose that's true. <laughs> You're a natural sailor, Duncan. I did a decent trick at the helm some time ago. Two years before the mast as a privateer. Dash my buttons. Your life seems a grand one, if I may say. So full of adventure. How marvelous. I've seen my share of strangeness, I. Very promising. All right, easy now. There you go. Welcome back. Well, your numbers look good. Now let's make sure we can break your brain, all right? I need you to move your head and look at these lights just here. Look up. That's it. Down. So far, so good. Let's get you up. So, welcome to the Sample 17 project. Before you get started, you're gonna need this. There you go. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Hello, bonjour. C'est bon? Hello, John Irony. Thanks for the good luck. All right. Let's take a walk. Your file says you've done some memory research before, but not to this extent, which is surprising. You're very good. The data streams are very stable. My ancestor lived in feudal Japan. I want to visit that. Or ancient Egypt. I've heard people talk about it. Impressive, right? 
This building is barely six months old, but Abstergo Entertainment has been a studio for a few years, since 2010. Maybe you saw Liberation? That was our first title powered by Animus Tech. That was just the tip of the iceberg. Soon, we'll be unveiling commercial Animus servers for the whole world to enjoy. They'll offer passive experiences, of course, edited versions of real history, but only the exciting parts. And we think we found the perfect subject for our first full-length virtual feature, Caribbean Pirates. So that's your gig. It'll just take a minute, okay? Well, thank you, Nancy. Bon journée. C'est bon, c'était prêt. Magnifique, merci. This is for you, the primary tool of our trade, your communicator. Power it up and give it a look, it's pretty slick. You might have noticed that security seems a little light around here. That's because your communicator is your key to getting around. See that flashing wireless signal? It means you're hooked up to the elevator. I'll let you do the honors. We're headed up to the Sample 17 studio, second floor. You ready? Let's go. Ah, there's the boss, Olivier Garneau, our CCO. I'll introduce you. Bonjour. Salut, Mélanie. Ça va bien? Well, thanks. Have you met our new hire? Just started today. I haven't. Bonjour. What project? Sample 17, the Kenway line. Hey them, Connor. Edward, the pirate. Ah, ar, yar, maybe. <laughs> Very exciting. Welcome aboard. Uh, Melanie, can we talk Hello, Fos Pampas. Just let me get this one settled and I'll see you in Thanks, five minutes. Thanks, good luck. Nice to meet you. So? This is the Sample 17 floor. We're diving into the memories of one very generous donor, Desmond Miles. We're pulling all the best stuff from his DNA, and hopefully one day we can forge some fantastic experiences from what we find in there. This pair of legs is John, one of the wizards in IT. He's just fixing something for you. Not fixing, calibrating. Calibrating, right. So here we are. Your very own Animus workstation. This is all yours, so sit back, relax, and find us some good footage. If you need any hints or tips, the Animus is loaded with tutorial programs, so you'll have no problems. And I'll check in on you later. Happy pirating. Welcome to Animus Omega, Abstergo Entertainment's proprietary ancestral memory research tool. If you have any questions, comments or concerns about how to operate your Animus console, please contact your project supervisor, Melanie LeMay. You have been registered as part of the Sample 17 project. Your primary research target is Edward James Kenway, born March 10, 1693, Swansea, Wales. Calibrations complete. All signs normal. All systems optimal. Extra neurotransmitters activated. Someone you know. No, no, no. Just putting on a friendly face. I shouldn't want to be mistaken for a pirate again. Right. Flash rogue like yourself must be cautious. Go tarry a bit while I conduct my meeting. It'd be a great relief to have a man of your stature nearby. In case of a misunderstanding. I can hang about. I might have a drink. Spend it. Drink. <laughs> well, they don't take kindly to pirates here, do they? 
Wonder how many stolen reals bought these men this perch. Hola, ladies. You don't know these women, do you? No. They charge money for that kind of privilege. A few dozen reals for every hour of knowing. Keen to meet them. No, goodness no, I'm, I'm a married man. Married man of their forte, mate. This rusty razor is nothing to admire. Even so, I fear a mere kitten walking so close upon you. Perhaps a small dagger would suit me. Let's see what he's selling. Maybe I'll buy a sword too. We'll both jump rank. Oh, we'll be quite the pair, you and I. Twin devils. <laughs> Buenos dias, Lend señor. us a few reals, then. I did save your skin. Ah, uh, of course. Cheers. That's a better fit for me. How do you fare? I had only enough for a small knife, sadly. Still, it'll do in a pinch. Oh, half a duck. Oh, no matter. I'll get us a better view. What are we looking for? Uh, a tavern. Courtyard interior. My goodness, you're an agile chap. Every finger's a fish hook. That's how you tell a true sailor. <laughs> yes, a fine way to put it. Uh. <sighs> I think I see the place. We're not far. Hang tight. I can't breathe. Stop or I'll break your knees when I catch you. You robbed the wrong man, mate. A fellow with dangerous friends. Of course I am. That filch was no fuss. Oh, yeah. <laughs> ah. You want a dust up? I'll give you one. <laughs> Come on, lads. I've seen bigger arms on a bird. Sorry about the swift exit. You don't mind me tagging along, do you? Not if you keep quiet and stay out of sight. Bonnet! I believe I'm getting the hang of this! Quiet! I fear they're onto us! Hang back.
best idea you've had today. Buenos dias, senores. You're late. Yes, sir. See, uh, we are very sorry. Our captain delayed us. Captain Mendoza? Yes, sir. He's very excited to meet you. Only he must be present for a, a, a hanging, senor. Hanging? Ah, I love a good hanging. Yes, sir. Very nice. If we hear the bell, we will go. Right. I'd love to. Especially if Captain Mendoza's pulling the trap. The man owes me money for the slaves I sold him. Of course, sir. Captain Mendoza is happy to pay you. We have goods to sell, sugars and such. Excellent. Quiero de su categoría acompañarte al callejón más cercano. Oh, sir, man. How long will this hanging take, man? We don't need to hang about all day for the captain. We can say anything, sir. Captain Mendoza needs only to hang the man, then he will deliver your payment. I don't want him. Tobacco, rum, sugar. to the Castillo. No, sir. Captain Mendoza will have it sent to you, I believe. You will see. Good Lord. Is that big brute your Captain Mendoza? No, sir. He is El Tiburón. El Tiburón, Governor Torres's man. Hey, Joe.
Ven a probar los puñuelos. Sorry about the sugar. I've only one pair of hands. Oh, it's no great loss. Uh, I've got uh, plenty of cargo here to make a profit on my trip. Will you stay here long? For a few weeks, yes. Then back to Barbados, to the tedium of domesticity. Don't settle for tedium. Sail for Nassau. Live life as you see fit. <laughs> Haven't I heard that Nassau is crawling with pirates? Seems a very tawdry place. Not tawdry, liberated. Oh, God. That would be an adventure. But no. No, I'm a husband and a father. I have responsibilities. Life can't be all pleasure and distraction, Duncan. Hey, our bonnet. The name's Edward, in truth. Duncan's only a handle. Ah. Secret name for your secret meeting with the governor. The governor, right. I think I've kept him waiting long enough. Para. 
Venga, no bajéis el ritmo. Podría darle entre las cejas. Más rápido. Buenos días, Mr. Duncan Walpole of England to see the governor. I believe he is expecting me. Oh, Damien. Sí, señor Walpole. Entre, por favor. ¿Ese es el hombre? El... ¿Cómo lo llamabas? ¿Asesino? Sí, Duncan Walpole. Debería haber llegado hace muchos días. No me gusta que los extranjeros se paseen por nuestra ciudad. No me fío de ellos. Cállate. El gobernador tiene invitados. Todos, franceses e ingleses. Le suponía un respeto más... respetable. Llévame ese, señor Tamar. Sí. You've got my two best pairs of matched pistols, Duncan. So handle them with care. If I had eight, I'd treat each as my own son. Pull off a few shots, if you like. Get a feel for it. <laughs> I once fought beside a man who carried nine on his person. They were a boom in battle, but hindered his ability to swim, sadly. <laughs> Quite. Good kick, yes? I long for the day where one firearm carries four bullets, and not the opposite. I have a friend in England you may like to meet, Julian. James Puckle. He's working on something extraordinary. Magnifique. All right. Here's a simple to try to strike every time before the power empties. Remember, hit every target within the allotted time. Two blades, as is the custom, eh? Custom, aye. Duncan, will you indulge us with a demonstration of your techniques? Well, I... Uh... We must. We put together a training course in anticipation of your arrival. It would be a shame to leave here without seeing you in action. Yes, of course. Well, I mean, if there is time, I would gladly, uh, show you what I know. Here. You see? Situations well suited to your skills. Have a go. A blade in a crowd is always the simplest. Some grandiose. Just so quick and another clean. Thing. The assassins have trained you well, Duncan. You chose a perfect time to leave them behind. At great risk, I imagine. Betraying the assassins is never good for one's health. Well, neither is drinking liquor, but I am drawn to its dangers all the same. And what is your business here, sir? Are you an associate of the governor's, or a pending acquaintance like myself? Guns, blades, cannons, grenados... <laughs> Anything that may kill a man, I am happy to provide. A smuggler of sorts. And how is your wife these days, Captain Rogers? Is she, uh, here, in Havana? I trust she's well, but I wouldn't know. I've been in Madagascar some 14 months hunting pirates. It took some work to dislodge the criminals there, but we managed it. In future, I hope to use these same tactics throughout the West Indies. And how did you deal with that kind? Very simply. Most pirates are as ignorant as apes. I merely offered them a choice. Take a pardon and return to England penniless, but free men. Or be hanged by the neck until dead. Oh. I imagine Nassau would be your next target. Very astute, Duncan, indeed. Best of luck with that.
intervened at last. Decades ago, the Council entrusted me with the task of locating in these West Indies a forgotten place our precursors once called the Observatory. See here. Look upon these images and commit them to memory. They tell a very old and important story. For two decades now, I have endeavored to locate this observatory. A place rumored to contain a tool of incredible utility Hello, and President. power. It houses Thanks a kind of artillery sphere, if you like. A device that would grant us the power to locate and monitor every man and woman on Earth, whatever their location. Only imagine what it would mean to have such a power. With this device, there would be no secrets among men, no lies, no trickery, only justice, pure justice. This is the observatory's promise, and we must take it for our own. Do we know its whereabouts? We will soon, for in our custody is the one man who does, a man named Roberts, once called a sage. It has been 45 years since anyone has seen a true sage. Can you be sure this one is authentic? We are confident he is. The assassins will come for him. Indeed. Rest well, Duncan. Tomorrow the treasure fleet arrives, and with it, your reward. After which we will discuss further schemes. I look forward to it. Excelente. Meet me down at the docks first thing tomorrow morning. Governor Torres requests your presence at the docks near the Castillo. First thing tomorrow morning. Such a fuss over one man. Is the observatory really such a grand prize? I see. I see me do that. The observatory was a tool built by the precursor race. Its work is without measure. Precursor race? I see. One of your early letters mentioned a desire to kill the Mayan mentor, Atabai. Were you able to carry out this contract before coming here? I... I was not, no. Too many complications along the way. A pity. But the maps you delivered with the blood vial will see that job finished. Aye. That's the idea. I don't like this route, Torres. You're exposed. Something is wrong. Stay close, Grandmaster. I feel it too. Do not let them get their hands on the stage, whatever costs. <laughs>
You're a nimble one, I'll give you that. Well done, lapdog. Quiet. We'll see him to the prisons, Grandmaster. Double the watch. Well, I'll be buggered. What an active day we've had, gents. See, si, set on all sides by our enemies, we must be more cautious. I do wish I could remain to see our drama done, but I must avail myself of these winds and sail for England. By all means, Captain, speed and fortune to you. <laughs> with luck, I'll return myself a governor. And with my idiot king's blessing, no less. Adios. As for you, Mr. Walpole, I consider this the first payment in a long-term investment. Gracias. Obliged. I would like you to be present for the interrogation tomorrow. Call around noon. Yes, sir. Days hunting.
una pregunta para ti. for a drink, Edward. Ahí. ¡Alerta! ¡Alerta! Se habrá dado un para Dios. Se habrá dado un toque para Drink, Edward. God. What is your true name, Rogue? It's a... Uh... Captain Pissoff. Bien que pauvre Pisa. Where is this sage? Did you set him free? I had nothing to do with that. Much as I wish I did. Take him to the ports. Send him to Sevilla with the treasure. Wait up! 
I delivered your treasures, didn't I? Indeed, yes. But you robbed us of Duncan Wallow. You hungry? Oh, goes to Sparta. Thanks for the look. Now, what's your plan, mate? Que Dios nos ayude. No me gusta la pinta de esa tormenta que se acerca. Parece que se está desviando al oeste, hacia el Golfo. Quizá estemos a salvo. Tú, el canalla intenta escapar. Prisoners held on this ship. Set them free, they'll sail with us, no question. So that's the idea then. Free what men we can, then find a fast ship to flee it. But there's a catch to this favor. Go sailing with me. I follow you to hell for this, mate. Make sure good luck. IPB is 13 hours 24 minutes. Come on, lads. If we're to drown today, it won't be here. Brig nearby, just waiting for us to take her. Oh, my old page, so good luck. on those galleons. See, they don't give us trouble. They won't. Far too slow for this weather. Bark any orders you think wise, mate. We're up against it here. 
These men know their place. They'll see us home. Not looking good. Steady as she goes, man. Close, Captain. By God, we pulled this one straight from the teeth of Neptune. I'm Edward. Much thanks for your aid back there. Adewale. You ever been to Nassau, Adewale? Not yet. By God, she took some knocks, didn't she? I think I'll keep her. All hands aft, lads! Taking this one home. I spied a few items in the hold earlier. Powder and a few pistols. I think I'll fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> it's a good start. One you find laughable. Will we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had a walk about the gun deck this morning and couldn't stand for what I saw. A clutter of lint stalks heaped like tinder, and one with a slow match still burning. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of gunpowder, closer than man and wife, fit to explode at the touch of a spark. We'll stow ours good and proper. As for the cannons, they might as well be tossed. Clogs touch holes in need of scraping, corrosion on the bodies, barrel swabs as naked as knives, and breech ropes so rotted, I could use them for knitting yarn. The short of it is, we need good equipment kept in fine condition. But we cannot win every battle with snares and shouts. Don't worry about your own armaments when it suits you. 
But don't forget about your jackdaws. Despite a few items in the hold earlier, powder and a few pistols. I think I'll fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> it's a good start. One you find laughable. Could we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had a walk about the gun deck this morning and couldn't stand for what I saw. A clutter of lint stocks heaped like tinder, and one with a slow match still burning. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of gunpowder, closer than man and wife. Fit to explode at the touch of a spark. Every Despite a few items in the hold earlier. Powder and a few pistols. Think I'll fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> it's a good start. One you find laughable. Could we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had a walk about the gun deck this morning, and couldn't stand for what I saw. A clutter of lint stocks heaped like tinder, and one with a slow match still burning. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of gunpowder, closer than man and wife. Fit to explode at the touch of a spark. We'll stow ours good and well. As for the cannons, they might as well be tossed. Clogs touch holes in need of scraping. Corrosion on the bodies, barrel swabs as naked as knives, and bleach ropes so rotted, I could use them for knitting yarn. The short of it is, we need good equipment kept in fine condition. But we cannot win every battle with snares and shouts. So worry about your own armaments when it suits you. But don't forget about your jackdaw as well. No, indeed. We'll make it a point to keep this ship and its crew in fine condition. Despite a few items in the hold earlier, powder and a few pistols. Think I'll fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> it's a good start. One you find laughable. Could we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had a walk about the gun deck this morning and couldn't stand for what I saw. A clutter of lint stocks heaped like tinder, and one with a slow match still burning. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of gunpowder, closer than man and wife. Fit to explode at the touch of a spark. We'll stow ours good and proper. As for the cannons, they might as well be tossed. Clogs touch holes in need of scraping, corrosion on the bodies, barrel swabs as naked as knives, and breech ropes so rotted, I could use them for knitting yarn. The short of it is, we need good equipment kept in fine condition. But we cannot win every battle with snares and shouts.
Shamans! Fire! Fire! Don't I did it again! Oh, what the nice. Okay. Despite a few items in the nice holster, most... powder and food. Yeah, I couldn't turn my. I got fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> I couldn't turn start. my. What do you find laughable? Could we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had How a walk about the gun deck this morning. Camera forward for some reason. I a so I couldn't go up and you can. Like tinder. And one with a yeah, this would be a huge thing, boss. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of uh, gunpowder. I was still out of time. Wife, fit to explode at the touch of a spark. Oh, yeah, man, go to reset. As for the cannons, they might as well be tossed. And I got such a good Clubs energy here. Scraping, yeah, corrosion let's go this up. Barrel swabs as naked as knives, and breech ropes so rotted. And yeah, there are no ships there anymore. The short of it is. We need good equipment kept in fine <gasps> It is, but it is. Win every battle with snares yeah, we'll lose like two minutes. So worry about your own armament when it suits you. But don't forget about your jacket. just couldn't turn the camera no, at all. We'll make it a point to keep this it's ship stuck. and its crew in fine condition. Get them alone! Yeah, it's part of it really bad. Yeah, look at that. One minute lost, and I will lose more because of the. I need. I still need to get uh, the ship with cargo. Well, it is what it is. Can I go in? Ahoy, Captain. Find what you need. My needs and wants are oceans apart, mate. But I did fashion myself a new holster. All I need now is a pistol to lie in it. Taken from the holds, just as you said. Little more than a blowpipe. But it'll do. So, are we rested? Or should we idle a while longer? Best way, Anchor. I think the crew is itching to reach civilization. You'll find no civilization in Nassau. But it's a fine place to be merry all the same.
ready, sir! Fire! We can join their command! We're ready, sir! Fire! Drag them to that team! Captain Queer Nubs, tell me I'm under arrest. Tell me! Damn your breaths. Fly away, boyo, back to your master. Aye, we was privateers together before the wars ended. I'll see you ashore. My God. Send any men you find to the jackal. Cheers, Addy. Send any men you find to the jackal. Cheers, Addy. Send any men you find to the jackal. Cheers, Addy. Send any men you find to the jackal. Cheers, Addy. What's all this pissing and moaning about? Has something happened? Soldiers, that's what happened. Sent by the king. This pirate bears the blood of many innocents. Stand still. A moment more. Well done, Edward.
know you'll want to sail somewhere rich with plunder. Have you heard of a place called the Observatory? Aye. It's an old legend, like El Dorado or the Fountain of Youth. What have you heard? It's meant to be a temple or a tomb, hiding a treasure of some kind. That's it. You see here. Oh, all right. It's fairy stories you prefer a gold, is it? It's worth more than gold, Thatch. Ten thousand times above what we could pull off any Spanish ship. Robbing the king to pay his porpoise is how we earn our keep here, lad. It ain't a fortune. It's a fantasy. I take pride in piloting my own ships, Ben. Keeps me alert. Let's make some headway, shall we? I've no need for schooling. How many prizes did we take together as privateers? <laughs> There's a chasm of difference between joining a raid and captaining one. We're looking out for merchants, boys! Them that's fat with cargo! After you subdue a promise, project authority, demand respect that you would never give yourself. This leads to spell and soft. Que tengo un buen día, señor. I am Captain Hornigold, and this is my crew. We're sailors like yourselves, but quite unalike in our purpose. For we intend to take all that you owe. Yet no harm shall befall any man so long as he remains at ease. Is that clear? No me mate, señor. Tengo familia. Se lo suplico. Anyone speak English? English. Little bit. Tell your friends we're stealing your goods. And we won't hurt nobody if everyone stays as still as a sandbar. You got that? Please do repeat. Oh, for fuck's sake. Lock them in the hold and take everything that isn't nailed down. scores of that size and you'll be set for a year now let's sell this cargo and fix up your jack door with a few more trinkets sod it you i'm looking for a prize that'll set me up for life i'll be king of the west indies then we came to nassau to get away from the likes of kings well i'll be a man of property and promise anyway jesus let that dream go lad. nassau is the place to be not in do you ever dream of the big score? Good take today, Kenway. Half a dozen scores of that size and you'll be set for a year. Now let's sell this cargo and fix up your jack door with a few more trinkets. Sod it, yeah. I'm looking for a prize that will set me up for life. I'll be king of the West Indies, then. We came to Nassau to get away from the likes of kings. Well, I'll be a man of property and promise anyway. Jesus, let that dream go, lad. Nassau is the place to... Actually, I really doubt it. They have a better looking water in the newer games, the newer Assassin's Creed games. So skull and bones, so skull and bones should have a better water. This game and uh, right now they have more better textures like, like 4k textures this game has 
really bad textures, very low res. So, it's like one of the bad things about visuals in this game. And not very detailed models. Modern games have much more detailed models. How it feels and how it looks is a different thing. As you've likely seen, the number how it's of optimized is a different thing. Three score the number of military ships. You just cannot be uh, better looking. So to lure the navy out of hiding, worse looking than this game. It's impossible. This game is just too old. Go down without an honest fight. Who's up for taking that brig, lads? Shall die. This game was really badly run when it came out as well. I don't even know if we would optimize such as good games exist. Here right now. Every last grab of duck on the wind. As you've likely seen, the number of merchants roving these waters is three score the number of military ships. Aye, easy purchase, but in small doses. Right. I'm saying that almost every Ubisoft game is badly optimized on launch. This game was badly optimized on launch. It ran like shit. Even now it runs like shit if you enable physics. This is, this is without physics. Yeah, and physics completely broken on the new video cards in this game. So yeah, that is also awesome. So I for example cannot run this game at maximum settings. Because this is not the maximum settings. Captain has Get the Yeah, and even with not, not maximum settings, this game for me often dips below 60 FPS. That's how well optimized this game is. 10 years later, like on 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 free on 370. How cool is it? As you've likely seen, the number of merchants roving these waters is three score the number of military ships. Aye, easy purchase, but in small doses. Right. So to lure Fair the navy out of hiding, military class brings on the best of powers of an army man. Are you ready for this, cowboy? She won't go down without an honest fight. Who's up for taking that brig, lads? Shall die. Right to quarters. All hands to cannon! Careful around the navy. There is likely to ram you as far as broadside. Let's test this powder battle. Aye, good thinking. Awaiting your mark, Captain.
Captain has the helm. All in the stun zone. Loose topsails, gallants and royals. Fire up, hunters. Ghost the gallants and royals. Awaiting orders! Fire! Fire! Working on it, Hardy, sir! Come down to the ship, can we? Swim the yards on the way! Ah! Yeah. That was a bumper, my God. How do we fat? Five times with no mistake. Now I think it's time to lay low and drive on the back to the secrecy. Agreed. So, how do we get rid of this notoriety that's stirred up? Money, my boy! Well placed drive to the right government official. See the military off your tank. Right, let's do that. I'll need to meet these bits and out at some point. You're a wonder, Kenway. You've a knack for this kind of work. It ain't work if you love it. Ah, ah, ah. But I ain't doing this forever, lads. Only until I get enough coin to buy some land and influence back home. <laughs> Jesus, will you listen to your tripe? Still dreaming on about that strumpet back in England when you could have any better you wanted here and now. Ah, such lofty goals for you gents. And here I thought I was in the company of scoundrels. Fine purchase today. What's the crew's mood? All smiles and no teeth. And there's a few talking about meeting with Master Kid to steal from a nearby plantation. Plantation? That's ambitious. Profitable too, if we can manage it. Aye. It's a good idea. Estoy pacifista. 
más proceso. and royals. The worst old ship that ever did sail sailed on a heritage on a windy day and we're waiting for the day waiting for the day waiting for the day that we get on she was built in Roman times, held together with pits and twine. And we'll wait for the day, wait for the day, wait for the day, and we get our bag. Nothing in the galley, nothing in the hole, we'll skip and turn in with a bag of gold. And we'll wait for the day, wait for the day, wait for the day, then we get our bag. Oh, goodness, they sprang a leaf, here and pour out in the street. And we'll wait for the day.
Why, look. It's the... The Mr. Beckford that owns this plantation. That's the man. He owns dozens round these islands. And he's bloody rich. Yes, he thought I'd like to be robbed. That'll do. And how? Captain, you have the look of a man crafting a bold idea. Look I've seen before. You mark well, Ade. I've just overheard one of the Beckford's men talking grandly about his plantation and all the cargo he's keeping there. And it gave me the idea that I might take these goods off him and sell them off for a better price than he'd ever ask. <laughs> ah, a man of vision. I like this idea. We must tread lightly! These waters are well guarded, sir! Hold on it. There's trouble of fall. I see them. Clip edge! Douse the gallants and royal! Get them aloft! Off. Douse all sail! Spots up with a will! This man's working for Peter Beckford's people. Do you know them? The Beckfords and their sugar empire. I. The Beckfords and the Draxes. Oh, Nicholas. Thanks so much. But you worked a plantation, no? A modest one, I. As a striker in the boiling house. Boiling house? Was it water they boiled? Or something else? Cane juices. So 
hard process making sugar. Dangerous. Must be why it fetches such a dear price. What's it like, toiling on a plantation day and night? Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, it's run between two metal rollers and crush the juice from the plant. After collecting the juice, it's time to boil away the water from the sugar. This we did in tatches made of copper. But let me tell you, brother, boiling sugar is near the hottest thing on earth. Just a touch on the skin will stick like wood lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. It's a risk to anchor too close. The soldiers roving the plantation would catch us for sure. Drop here then and sneak ashore. We'll look after the jackal. such disarray. Bit of a do, sir, that's all. It's Wilmington's birthday. And you saw fit to get pickled on duty. No bother, sir. We have everything sorted. We'll soon see, won't we? For you must double the watch this evening. Double, sir? Whatever for? I believe I was followed here, young man. By pirates, if my eyes on me. Though the ship was uncommonly large for such rascals. Certainly wasn't slavers, though. Not a ship that size. In any case, double the watch. And keep your damned eyes wide for anything suspicious. You up there! Look alive, man! You've a job to do! Apologies, sir. I'll keep my eyes peeled. going on here today? How do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk and barely able to stand? I'd like to speak to the man in charge here. I require entrance to the warehouse. Which of
Hold that. Die! You really think we won't catch you? Ah, oh, clear oh. off! Hold that! I'll cave your scully! Hey! Hold on! I can get him from here! That'll do. And how? Jackdaw handles knives. Pinched her from the Spanish, was it? Aye. In the midst of a hurricane. Just before the treasure fleet was smashed against the shore. Was the hall aboard as rich as men are saying? A thousand times that. I reckon a million pounds worth of reals was sunk that day. Devil love a hurricane. Might have a dive there one day. See what we can rummage up. Diving them wrecks would be a nice change of pace for us. No need for violent actions against merchants and such. Well, that's some soft talk coming from a pirate. And as it happens, I mostly agree. We'll save the clashing of cutlasses for the military. And them that get in our way. Easy as she goes. Don't 
Telling what you may find out here. Like staring through a waterfall. Don't saw your breeches, lads. I got this. of yours. Not a man I call a friend. But we've been doing this kind of work for so long. I can't help to respect you. Fire! 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 Fire!
sailing for that island. I know the place. A natural stronghold used by a French captain named Cass. Julian de Cass, the Templar. Named right. Didn't know he had a title. I know the man. And if he sees my ship, he'll know it from his time in Havana, meaning he may wonder if I'm sailing or not. I can't risk that. And I don't want to lose that galleon. Let's think on. Maybe wait till it's dark before hopping aboard. Trinidad to see Sally Brown, boys. Row, boys, row, boys, row. Down to Trinidad to see Sally Brown, boys. Gentlemen!
¡Alto ahí! ¡No escaparás tan fácilmente! ¡Alto ahí! the gift you gave me. Well, it answers just fine. Fist of Pitra! As bold as a musket ball, and still half as sharp. I'm sorry about this, mate, but I can't risk you telling your Templar friends about me still kicking around. I pity you, Bukenyi. After all you have seen, after all we showed you of our order, still you embrace the life of an ignorant and aimless rogue. What's this? His petty larceny, the extent of your ambition. Have you no mind to comprehend the scope of ours? All the empires on Earth, abolished, a free and open world, without parasites like you. Que l'enfer que tu trouveras soit le fruit de ton insouciance. He's ours! Hey! 
I just saw you were logging out, so I thought I'd stop by and give you something. A little welcome gift. We give awards to our top-notch employees for doing quality work. And they're nice to have, since there's no official bonus scheme here. I already have about 11 or so. Oh. Bonjour. Of course. I'll pass it on. Well, looks like Olivier wants to meet with you. It's exciting. Follow me. It's on the top floor, so it's not hard to find. But the rest of this building can be confusing to first-timers, so we had the tools team whip up a great map application. Check your communicator. I added a waypoint to Olivier's office. Should be easy to find. Olivier's a nice guy. He won't bite. You are specifically ordering me to abandon it. I won't uh, jeopardize our flagship project. Edward Kenway is the. But this is. But this is how Hollywood got its start, right? With pirate movies. Douglas Fairbanks, Errol Flynn, and now we have access to the real deal. <sighs> We're waiting. Exactly. We'll talk about all that together at the shareholders' event. Right. Looking forward to seeing you too. Take care, this year. Salut! Hi! Thanks for coming in. I know you're busy. So, I reviewed some of your data. Pretty raw stuff. Obviously, we need to scrub off some of the dirt to make it family friendly. Edward avoids like uh, James Bond or something. More of a Hi, John from IT again. You got a second? Good. I'm adding a waypoint to your map. So, uh, a colleague of yours left for vacation this morning and forgot to send a video file she promised me. Since I hate just about everyone else on your floor, I was hoping you could help me. Could you transfer the file from her computer and deliver it to the courier when she comes? It'll be easy. You just wander over to their animus, log in, and transfer the file. Easy. And please be snappy before I find a reason to hate you, too. A locked door? <laughs> Not a problem. That's the advantage of me having level one security clearance. Now, you do, too. Don't abuse it. Log on, and I'll walk you through this. Now, you need to bypass the core to find the data inside. Once you reach it, your communicator will download it automatically. You need to find your way around the core to reach the data you inside. Cracked it. Good. The file should be downloading. I set up a database for any data you find. Just look for the My File section in your communicator, and you'll be redirected right away. Everything you download will be found in there. Uh, protected by a firewall, of course. Oh, you're better at this than I'd hoped. Now zip on down to the lobby, come on. See, that file you acquired? I wouldn't recommend watching it. I mean, ooh, you could, 
but it's unpleasant. So once you hand it off, just pretend this never happened, okay? Otherwise, you'll just go to bed feeling sad. Anyway, the courier should be waiting downstairs. She's been here a while. I suppose it goes without saying, just because you now know how to hack all your no, colleagues' your computers, computer shit, it doesn't mean you should. Correct. I mean, not every day, right? No, no, <laughs> no, seriously, no, that's I illegal. Follow. Probably... Oh, look who's here. So you didn't forget, after all, you're just incredibly rude. And made poor Rebecca here wait for nearly 30 minutes. You lie me. Be nice. Sorry about him. He's high on his own supply. So, how should we do this? Data transfer? Great. That should do it. We'll email you the receipt. Till next time. Take care, Sean. Bye-bye. Yes, bye. And don't expect Which any more free coffee. Which of the racing games? Origins is the most acclaimed. But Valhalla is best selling. So take it as you like. They are very different from each other. So. All origins and Valhalla are kinda similar, but Where you go in the what is she is quite no, different I... from My other two. Asked me to come live with them, and I'd like to. Oh, what do you mean? And definitely more different than me. I'm sorry, Edward, James before but my father it, is right. Then. You had a decent wage when you worked the farm. Why can you not be satisfied with that? With and all three games uh, successful. That job was near as damn it to robbery. You want to be married Much more successful than this game, right, for Edward. example. All right. You leave now, Caroline. You'll never know what's coming to us. Caroline! You must see this. Come on, man. Concentrate and focus all your senses. Concentrate and focus all your senses. Look past shadow and sound. Think into nothing. Until you see and hear a kind of... Concentrate and focus all your senses. Ah, right. I know this feeling. I have since I was a lad. It's like using every sentence. 
I found something else just here. I think you'll take to this secret much faster. Now this has the makings of a mystery. It's good, isn't it? Only wait till you see what lies at the end. Here we are. What do you think? I think Monsieur de Cass was a man of many secrets. Aye, and look here. A solid staircase leading God knows where. What do you suppose lies at the top? From what I knew of de Cass, I wouldn't be surprised to find eclectic instruments of torture and villainy. An Iron Maiden or a collection of thumbscrews. Or a pair of anguish. <laughs> Leaving already. I think this cove suits you best, Edward. Better than that costume does. Oh, come on now. We're pirates, kid. We take as we please and become who we like. Self-made man. But that look ain't you. It's not who you are. Who am I then? Hard to tell some days. All I know is you like dangerous prizes. Like the observatory. I think you know more about that than you let on in NASA. You noticed that, did you? Meet me at 20 degrees, three minutes latitude, just off the coast of Yucatan. I'll have something to show you there in a few weeks' time. Captain, we found a trove of no- It's our course today, Captain. It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'll be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Ade. <laughs> and what's your aim? Master Kid hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down in Tulum. Quite some distance, mind, on the Yakutan Peninsula. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way of picking away at my conscience that gives me pause. I should go see him soon. kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'd be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman. And what's your aim? Master Kid looked at a prize he was able to show me down in Tulum. Quite some distance from the Yakutan Peninsula. Do you trust him to play? I can't be sure. 
Alchemy cancel concept and Ubisoft for the last like five years is the most influential developer in terms of open world games. The only thing that our company invented is disable the map for Breath of the Wild, even though Breath of the Wild is still like uh, the same Ubisoft formula. But the rest is uh, they do first usually, and now I repeat, always repeat, even Rockstar. Yeah, Rockstar doesn't haven't done anything new since GTA 4, I think. It's last time they actually made any serious breakthroughs in that regard.
Captain has the helm. Seems you could use a little help disappearing. Might I be of assistance? Well done. Unto my mind. Godness. Okay. No, it was... well, I guess yes, I almost didn't get it. Yeah, first one was bad. Oh, look at that, nice. I just have to get a little bit closer. Uh, only some nice spawns in this mission. I never get a good, a good, sp good spawns in this mission. Reload! What Ready to Of course today, Captain. It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'll be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, I didn't. No, I didn't get to be recently. Hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down Just, in the I can save a lot of time on this, huh? You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way of pecking away at my conscience that gives me pause. I should go see him soon. So long as we take some prizes along the way, I'm sure the crew will understand. I'll set the course for Tulum.
Another keystone. Today, Captain, it's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'll be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Adam. <laughs> and what's your aim? Master Kidd hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down in Tulum. Quite some distance, mind, on the Yakutan Peninsula. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way of picking away at my conscience that gives me pause. I should go see him soon. So long as we take some prizes along the way, I'm sure the crew will understand. I'll set the course for Tulum. today, Captain. It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it into ourselves, I'd be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, I think. And what's your aim? Master Kidd came to get a prize and he's going to show me down to you. What's a distance, mind? I got to have convinced you. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way of taking the way of my conscience that gives me the Go see him. So long as we take some prizes along the way, I'm sure the crew will understand. Of course, we'll do it.
down on land, Captain. Ghost the gallants and royals. Read the mains. Clue up gallants. Hold of Hound, thanks for the good luck.
What's our course today, Captain? It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'll be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Ade. <laughs> and what's your aim? Master Kidd hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down in Tulum. Quite some distance, mind, on the Yakutan Peninsula. Oh, Lucas, thanks for the good luck. Yeah, I'll try. Hello, Selic. Thanks for the good luck. Ah, another Mayan keystone. We're on to something. I can feel it. Captain Kenway? What is the assassin, Dunker Walpole? Dead and buried. After he tried to kill me. We are not sorry to see him gone. But it was you who carried out his final betrayal. Why? Money was my only aim. Should I find comfort in that? You murdered our brothers and sisters in Havana. 
He has the sense, mentor. James tells me you treated with the Templars there. Did you see the man they called the Sage? Aye. Would you recognize his face if you saw it again? I reckon so. I must be certain. Not a word. Come on. You walked me blind and backwards into this mess, kid. Who the hell was that jester back there? Atabai. An assassin. And my mentor. So you're all part of some daffy religion? We're assassins and we follow a creed, aye. But it does not command us to act or submit, only to be wise. Oh, do tell. I'd love to hear it. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. This is the world's only certainty. Everything is permitted. I like the sound of that. Thinking what I like and acting how I please. The way forward's blocked. That's a door, I reckon. I. There should be some way to open it. A mechanism somewhere. Like a capstan. Those blocks up there. Try so it's you them. lot them Templars have been chasing then. Until you came along and mucked things up, it was us chasing them. We had them running scared. They have the upper hand now. The door's mechanism seems to be broke. Let's find another way around. Follow on, man. Jump! be a great treasure beyond. Treasure? Right. Whatever's waiting at the end of this path had better be worth my time. That'll depend on you. How's that? I'm taking you to see speak on this I can handle myself. Is this it, then? The grand prize your mentor asked me to see looks nothing like the man they call the sage, I'm sorry to say. Keep your trousers tied up. One more riddle to solve. There's a difference between them animals on the statues and them on the floor. Can you see it? I one of them is predators. The other is prey. Jesus, that's him. Oh, same experience. I will take. Well, first one was alright. It was first try, but it was sketchy. 
and I spend longer than I supposed to on completing it. Still, I saved a lot of time. Hi. They meant to ask him about the observatory too, but he escaped. Ah. We're finished here. What the hell did I just see back there? Jim! Quiet. Use them darts on this one coming now. Quick. Quiet and effective, see? himself. Kids and run. Who's out there? See that mangy old codger? He's a Dutch slaver called Lawrence Prince. Living now like a king in Jamaica. Bastard's been a target for years. Bloody hell, we nearly had him. By God, you bravos are a cheery bunch, eh? All frowns and furrowed brows. Captain Kenway, you have remarkable skills. Thanks, mate. It comes natural. But you're churlish and arrogant. Prancing around in a uniform that you have not earned. Everything is permitted. Isn't that your motto? I absolve you of your errors in Havana and elsewhere. But you are not welcome here. Sorry, mate. Wish it were otherwise. Cheery bunch of mates you've got. You deserve scorn, Edward. Prancing about like one of us, bringing shame to our cause. And what is that? Your cause? To be blunt, we kill people. Templars and their associates. 
folks who'd like to control all the empires on Earth. Claiming it's in the name of peace and order. Sounds like the Cass's dying words. You see? It's about power, really. About lording over people. Robbing us of liberty. That another message from one of your friends? Bye. I'll show you. I know you ain't exactly impressed by our creed. So would the sight of money make you more friendly to our ways? As ever. <laughs> then work these contracts around the West Indies for us, and we'll pay you. As simple as that. the same as every other squat I've robbed this past year. Oi, oi. Why the long face? You fallen in love? <laughs> With your blouse. You're welcome to Nassau, gents. Everyone is that does their fair share. Fair share? What is this, a fucking monastery? Um, we was uh, led to believe that Nassau was a place where men did as they pleased. Safe keeping others from doing the same. Aye. Captain Thatch, as I live and breathe. What is this magnificent muzzle you've cultivated? Why fly a black flag on a black beard, Moody? What brings you two gents this far north? Word is, Cuban governor himself is fixing to receive a mess of gold from a nearby fort. Until then, it's just sitting there, itching to be took. Governor Torres himself, eh? Sounds promising. Welcome to Nassau, Captain Vane. Mr. Rackham. Uh, 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 now, uh, where can a man find a bit rough?
Well, I saw his videos, yes. Well, I think a lot of people saw his videos. Now let me work my magic. You require my services. You're all set. The free man. <laughs> No, I don't have favorite Assassin's Creed. They all the same to me. Oh, 
I forgot about one, one tower. Yeah, it was a little bit slow. Not really, only legendary ships and the failed optional objectives on missions can end the run. Well, if I play extremely badly, like that also is not worth it. But so far I should be very far, very ahead. Even with mistakes. Come on.
has the help.
Hey! in the fog. It looks like a ship. It looks like a ghost ship. Oi! Listen from the dead to sink us. Six action black. Yes, it's first try. It's first time I got the first try on this in the run. Yeah, I never got an I think first try because I actually improved my best time. So this my this was my best time. Get the main into the wind. For this legendary ship. No, I have two more ships left. If I do two more ships and I have like a... Well, the save amount, I guess, of time save will be like 15 minutes. So, it won't be like extremely bad second half and I still PB. 
Well, we can talk about BB. Yeah. Right now, like, like now, I'm just at this moment. I'm really fast. Like, I could have been like several minutes faster, but this is very, very fast. Overall. Thanks, so good luck. Dama Negra will be in two hours. Not, not really. So it's still very long to go for until Dama Negra. Oh, 
I would just play the game and not pay attention to dialogue. Like, I think a ton of people play the game for the story, so called story. It's kind of a general concept. Everyone always asks, what's the story in this game? Is it good? James Fox guy, thanks for the work.
One more for the collection.
Hold off, for God's sake. A weird question. Don't really understand what you want me to say. Uh, very quiet, 100%. So you need to do. No uh, matter how annoying they are. Not just changing that program. Nan called me governor, for instance, for I quit that post last year. Ah, I was not aware. <laughs> of so many churches in Kingston. And the English at last taken to converting their slaves to the Christian faith. Ha! Convert them? No, Starish. There's none here so foolish as them. Foolish? How do you mean? Is it not a sin to enslave a fellow Christian? 
Therefore, to transmute a slave's soul from animal to man would be tantamount to inviting one's cattle to the dinner table. Oh, give my invitation. But how far is it? We're nearly there. Stand your ground, slave, and face corporal punishment like a man. Why act like a man now, when you have denied me that right for 30 years? I find your bearing appalling, Prince. I believe all thinking, feeling men deserve respect and opportunity. Ah, oh, you Spaniards. Your long ties to the Moors have diluted your blood and softened your hearts. This is not to say I believe in the natural equality of all races or sexes. Surely mankind and intelligence should be. But there is no true profit to be gained by the practice of slavery. In the short term, it makes us money, see. But in the long term, then we are to keep in the Ah, but you and I serve old as we are. We'll not live to see that unfortunate day. So I bother. Virtue, if nothing else. Virtue? Ah, oh, Torres. I have no wish to waste my day chattering about slaves and their pitiable condition. Let us conclude this transaction, then celebrate as friends. There's stories about you too, sir. You were a governor in Florida for a time. See, si, see. Si. I am one of a number of civil servants in my family. A long line of politicians. I have always toyed with the idea of entering politics myself. Only I feel I have too much money and not enough years. Speaking of stories, Prince, I heard it said you were with Henry Morgan the day he sacked Panama. 1671, was it? Oh, it's all true, yes. But let us not overesteem the honors forged and run on the battlefield. That skirmish was a deadly one, and a tremendous waste of coin and resources. It wasn't until many years after that I sheathed my sword in favor of a far safer and yet more profitable venture. Capital and resources, that's where money is made. And sir, let me tell you, honor bought is more enjoyable than honor won, if a touch less perfect. Alone, Not alone, but certainly without colleagues. I took passage aboard a British merchant's brig. Ah. Cocked up my kill, Kenway. For a better cause. I'm going after 
Dr. Prince. Kid, no! Jim, stop! Not this time, Kenway. Come on, man! We can work this together! Your blade, kid. Damn you, old strats. Keep your natty hands off me. I can't let you kill those men, kid. Not until I found the sage. I've been stalking that pig for a week now, charting his moves, and here I find not one but two of my targets, and you robbed me of both. Patience, man. You have your kills. When I locate the sage, you're helping me take Prince. Got that? I could just switch in hours, which means.
old man. Oh yes, as I said, 13 hours, 14 minutes. Sometimes examples just have to be made. Hey, hey, now isn't that just the truth? It's an enticing stretch of land. So many acres cleared and ready for the cave. And yet I sense your reticence. Aye. It abuts one of the Maroons' favorite raiding passes. I'd no doubt lose foreman and have constant runaways among my laborers. It wouldn't linger here. The walls are here. Are we followed? We must warn the others. You got the information I need, mate. No! I've heard of your kind. Assassin, don't hurt me! All I want to know is where this slave is. Do you know of anyone being held? Especially... Please! Let me live! My wife and children! Come on, then! Out with it! Look near the windmill! See? Was that so hard? Found your men. The drunks and whores you call friends might help you now. What's this?
Where to next? <laughs> That's enough work for one night. Or do you grow fond of it? That's it. No Templar. What about the key? The Templar did not show himself. You will have your key next time. No, Anto, there is no next time. <laughs> when you discover your conscience, or admit how badly you want the key, there will be a next time. If you see Prince before I do, kill him, and there'll be a bit of coin in it for you. All right. Damn. How is he? Ground. Please, I've been shot. I need aid. Christ, Thompson, look at her. She's hurt. Dreadfully, sir. I'm poorly. All right. I'm faint. Take an arm, lass. 
Bless you, lads. He has sage. Whole game is just catching sage. Uh, that's why Taurus uh, came to him because he again, has sage as a slave, and Robert he wants to buy him. With a queer aversion to kindness. I suppose that's two men I've lost today. So, what's your real name, lass? Mary Reed to my mum. And them I call friends. But not a word of it to anyone. Or I'll unman you as well. Ah! <laughs> 
it is too quiet. I do not trust it. There will be more of them. Bring them out before they make way. You up uh, hello, Mr. Vyrotek. Thanks for good luck. Yeah, I'm ahead no, by a lot. Like... Whoever did this, 15 minutes at least. The Templar's name is Kenneth Abraham. If not 20. He will see the actual splits in... Uh, I don't know. May I join you? Evening. The more the merrier. I've just come from the barracks. I'm quite certain the new weapons shipments will end our maroon problem once and for all. That is the plan. That is the plan. Do you think they'll be expecting us? Most likely. They always do somehow. This time, it won't matter. <laughs> By at least 15 minutes, maybe more.
most likely more. Because I wasn't so far wasn't any bad in this like after the second legendary ship segment. Overall not the fastest of course, but pretty fast overall. Yes, this is war record pace, but it doesn't matter much <laughs> until I get all four legendary ships. I can be on like twice war record pace. Well, no, if I'm on twice war record pace, yeah. Guess even <laughs> legendary ships are really bad. Maybe I can continue. This doesn't matter until I pass all legendary ships. If I, I feel I keep this pace past legendary ships, then yeah. Like, more record is the most likely guaranteed. It'd be hard to screw up or run like that. With so much time save.
Columbus Campeador. Thanks for the good luck. Thanks for subscribing, Boss Campeador. Thank you very much. Another? A rum flip this time. And where'd I find fresh eggs in this wretched town? There's little else but piss and insects. Ah, we're working on that. Mm -hmm. Dear lady, what do they call you? And when mm. they're sober, a jilt when they're sauced. But never, lady. <laughs> well, good lad. I, I, uh, oh, no. Back your shot! You hear me? It's a back a bloody shot! It's a ruse to keep us off before they attack Nassau. You'll see, mark me. It's no ruse, Vein. I heard it straight from the mouth of a greasy Bermudan captain. There's a pardon on offer for any pirate that wants it. Ruse or no, I think it's plain the British may return to Nassau with arms, no doubt. We'll need a plan. Walk with us, can we? There's trouble brewing. What's your story? Yes. You want something? In the absence of any clear ideas, I say we lay low. No piracies and no violence. Do nothing to ruffle the king's feathers for now. Preserving the king's plumage is no concern of mine, Ben. It will be when he sends his soldiers to scrub this island clean of our residue. Look around you, man. Is this cesspool worth dying for? Aye! It's our republic! Our idea! A free land for free men, remember? So maybe it's filthy to look at. But ain't it still an idea worth fighting for? I can't be sure. But when I look on the fruits of our years of labor, all I see is sickness, idleness, idiocy. Not a sunbeam of difference between here and London, then, eh? That is right, man. Taking a wide view, we're not doing so bad out here. There's sun, rum, and leisure as far as the eye can see. Aye. Nassau may look fine from a distance, but at its core, there's a disease I cannot stomach. Sickness can be cured, Ben. If only you have the right medicine. But a corpse cannot be reanimated. I can't believe the shite I'm hearing drop from your lips. Why not take the pardon now, and be done with it? Peace, both of you. We can satisfy both aims if we work together. Find medicines to ease our burdens here, 
but in a way that don't attract the British. I wager the nearest doctor is sitting pretty in Havana. Not a place I need to go. But the Spanish fleet that sunk two years back would have some medicine. All sealed up in glass vials. You'd need a diving bell to reach those depths. Aye, and with some coin and a few supplies, a diving bell won't be hard to come by. This is a plan I can stand behind. Find medicines without stirring up trouble. Agreed, Thatch? Agreed! Aye. You've had enough. I'll meet you near the wrecks as soon as you're able. Remember, Thatch? El caballero está nervioso. Oh, 
¡Quieto ahí! ¡Listo para saltar! ¡Cogedlo! ¡Más rápido! ¡No debemos perderme! ¡La otra patrulla! ¡Dará cuenta! ¡Alarma! Aye, another keystone. Oh, my God. 
laser tag over there. Is this your new persona? Sir Edward of Havana rescues damsels in distress. And does it suit me, Mopsy? <sighs> Better than your old personality. Really, Edward, why are you here? Yes. Well, there's a key. Most likely in the pocket of your Templar suitor. I need it. Really? And why don't I want this key for myself? Rona, I know you're no stranger to a man's boots, but the suit this key unlocks won't fit you. I'll tell you what. If I think of a chore that requires the help of an especially simple fellow, I'll let you know. Have you reconsidered? por todos lados. ¡Allí está! ¡Lo tengo justo en la mira!
advertencia que oirás. What to find out? Admiten patar. No te dejaremos ¡Eh, escapar. ¿Qué? Green chips on and off which is the fastest way to reward save file. And a reward save file to appear in different place. Basically it's warps around the map. Because game actually each time game saves uh, it saves character in certain location. Not in the location but character is it's like bunch of spawn points on the map so that allows you to teleport there also to like lose immediately followers alerts and stuff come on No, it doesn't save your progress, but game already saved. Like, there are certain points where game auto saves. This game only auto saves. So, the game already saved.
and all I need now I need to reload the save to appear where where the game saved me. Yeah, this is Andy. Oh, he won't be hard to find. Cheeky bastard. Strutting about like the cock of the walk. Admitted, Rona. Deep down you like the walk of that cock. I can arrange to have you in Thumakins if Flogan's too kind, anyway. What I miss the most is the fox hunt. Of course this. Hey, Flint! Not much of a shot, are you, Flint? You should know, Finnboard. <laughs> soon see the pace like as you can see there's a there's a time on next split so just wait like five minutes and you will see what, what the pace is actually so i think like i'm 25 minutes ahead something like that more than 20 minutes, definitely. Hmm. Yeah, interesting. Yeah, this run is like really fast so far. Yeah, I changed where I do the Havana missions. But from next split it will be the same as it might, it might be. For a while. Then it won't be in, in, again. But yeah, for a while it will be. But yeah, I didn't expect this to be that fast so far. This is really fast so far. Oh yeah, this is a real time save. This is not like a fake or something. So why am I minus 25 right now? Which is, yeah, <laughs> the best I've done so far. My attempts.
Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, I don't see anything. Oh, okay. I see one. Okay, maybe because of the... Uh... Oh. Yeah, save time. From now on, a real splits. If I save time, then it's good. Oh, uh, ship sighted! Oh, she's a beast!
Yeah, so far the sound is insane. Yeah, so far this is like... Holy shit, the sound. Holy shit. The sound is insane so far, but yeah, we're not out of the woods yet. <laughs> pretty soon like in I guess like 20 minutes yeah all the is left which you can kill around and stuff so yeah not there yet not there yet
found one crate hidden beneath a school of sharks. Sadly, the elixir inside is quite spoiled. Plague and perish. Will we steal medicines now? Remember the pardon, Thatch. We're to be subtle. Says Ornigold, a pirate, now too proud to call himself one. He prefers caution to cannons. Caution's nothing without charisma. Or if a man plays the fool, then it's only fools he'll persuade, but appear to be the devil. And all men will submit. And would you be the devil? Find a quiet way to acquire medicines. Tell me soon. Otherwise, I'll handle it myself.
Lots of sail! Lose the main, half sails! More sail! All sail! Captain has the hand. Home. Get the main salt into the wind! Ship she sailed to Spain. Oh, oh, roll and go. There was a ship came home again. Tommy 
is on the top of the yard. Hey, what do you think was in her hole? Oh, 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 and oh. There's the was wild. nine oh. and there was one. Who up top? Douse those nails. So far it's very good, but I still have one more legendary ship left, so see how it will be after that ship. I will see. Crowd on every inch of sail. We ride the wind. Short and sail. Kill
Betsy Dawson, hey ho! She robbed the boss and hey ho! That was the caution, hey ho! He's on the way! Oh, yeah! Muscles are duck, my trunks! Watch this. One more for the collection. Hey, stop!
Let's move! Get on that main seat! Trim to! Start to... Yes, it's the last run killer in the sun. Well, also if I fail some optional objectives. Um, run is kind of dead as well. Yeah, we all are. Uh, oh, see. If it will be, it will be. If it won't be, it won't be. Good luck.
finally we're having a run, boys. We're having a run, boys. All ships first try, all of them. We're having such a run, boys. This is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> right, did he die? I think he did, right? Yeah. Alright, so this is like insane. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> yeah, this is... Wow. Oh, I have no words. <laughs> That juicy, juicy, juicy time save. Minus 30 minutes, minus half an hour. Almost minus half an hour. Alright, we have an amazing run. Now, do not screw this up. Yeah, best pace since 2018. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, this is sub 13 hour space. This is fa faster, uh, this is like 12, 54, 56. Yeah, but uh, it will be hard to lose that much time. It's still possible, but it will be difficult <laughs> to lose that much time. Save. Come on, come on, come on. Still possible though, so yeah, still need to do like seven more hours. But yeah, this is good, like, safety thing. Yeah, I think I will do that mission in sequence 10 as safe as possible. Hopefully we will save some time, uh, but we'll see, we'll see. May lose time when we split because of the uh, ship spawn. Well, it's fine. We're headed the Should overall save time. Because there is like uh, still several time saves. This one. Left. Pretty big ones, like several minutes. Yeah, hopefully it goes well. Yeah, now to focus, to focus, to focus. Yeah, wow, this was like... Shit. This was insane. I have no words.
Trinidad to see Sally Brown, boys. Go, boys! Ease off the wind! Down to Trinidad Brothers, to see Sally the wind. Brown. Call it all day! Yes, I did. Hey boys, oh as I was going to Derby, it was on a market day. I met the finest ramser that ever was fed up on a. That's a lie. That's a lie. That's a lie. A lie. A lie. This ram and I got drunk. Human Fluxon! Clip ahead, sir! Coral in the stunts! Ahoy along! Bring it all in! Time's up, son! <laughs> Thank you. 
Captain, there's a wreck yonder. Looks recent. I see it. Let's hope Thatch hasn't come to the same end. Another bit of wreckage, Captain. This is looking grim. Aye. Keep your eyes peeled. Blast. This is getting well out of hand. A dozen crates of medicine should not be so hard to come. That ain't my meaning. Thatch and Hornigold and this pointless feud of theirs. Aren't you feel that? But is that the best course for us? Saving a city that ain't worth much. We're not men made to govern. We take and spend and live heartily wherever we go. What solution would you propose? The answer's in wealth and power, not politics. If we found the observatory, We'd see enough money to buy the whole of England. Or it might be, we'd lord over these kings and emperors like they was peasants themselves. A lot of large talk, Captain. I mean the best for these men, Ade. I do. But this don't sit right. I feel like I'm running errands, not living my life. Get the main! See that? It's her, Captain, the Queen Anne's Revenge. A 
and she's in a bad way. No time for a boat. Thatch is outnumbered. The crew will understand. Beat the quarters, lads! We're sailing into hell! Oh, God! Uh, uh, some aid here! Edward, please! Hang in there, Bonnie. Keep your arms up and your back to the sea. You stirred up a mess of trouble, Thatch. In service of a noble cause! Mentions, I hope you mean. Shite. You'll be hanged and sun-dried, just as them there were in Boston. The king's called for a pardon. <laughs> Captain, we've searched the hold. It's a middle intake. But the medicine we found bears a Charles Town stamp. Thank you, Mr. Hans. We cannot resupply Nassau out here by force and accident alone. We should go to Charlestown for the lot. Yeah, that's a whole mission. Bad, bad ship RNG. I fear I am not built for the fatigue and care required to live as a man of fortune. And yeah, I kind of screwed up this fight. Mm, fight was slow. A shot. Ah, it's fine. Ah, yeah, this is extremely slow.
Hey. be hard. Ah. ah, Mr. Kenwick. Stand still. It's not Christian. This is more like it.
Hello, Isprom. Start to the wind! Yeah. 
Rain's out. Let's go. Reef in all top. Dad to see Sally Brown, boys. Roll, boys, roll, boys, roll. Down to Trinidad to see Sally Brown, boys. Sally, Sally. Hey, old bonnet. Flying your own flag at last. Yes. Yes, Blackbeard cut me loose, sadly. Time to have a go at this myself. Well, that's grand. Yes, it's for the best, I think. I should have some wild Hello, stories Thanks for the good luck. Edward! Your constant friendship has been my most treasured find on these seas. Well above gold and silver and rum, I, I prize the courage you have inspired in me this year. Thank you, sir! A fair good morrow to you! There's movement up ahead. Is it soldiers? I am in something of a hurry. I propose we follow, else they spring something we ain't ready for. More sail. All we've got. What's your thinking? Blackbeard's been at this eight days already. So it's a good bet someone out there has prepared the medicines. Just in case. Ah, but they're stalling. Thinking of ways to avoid paying it out. Aye, so let's find where they've gathered and hope for the best. Come off the wind, some loose the stunts. Careful, Captain. We're drifting close to a watchtower. Just close to the business series. There's another watchtower. Blew up, short and safe. Keep her at half sail, Captain. The speed will do us no favors here. Careful with the banks. We cannot pass them undetected, Captain. And there is no other way. There's always another way. All stop! Lose the 
I see them. Over there. Let us hope the river remains this wide. The ship's built for the open ocean. Not stalking by you, If we run aground here, we may never get out. Be sure they don't spy us trailing them. Aye, sir. Interloper, raise the alarm! Almost there. Good. Captain Wyatt is not a patient man. Simon! It's this crocodile! I don't care about your accidents. What's the word from the harbor, soldier? Speak. No change, sir. They're holding fast, but are yet to kill or maim any of the captives. Near as we can tell. Perhaps it's time to... To surrender? I've been entrusted with the affairs of the town, and I do not intend to bow to the demands of a pirate, no matter how fierce his reputation. Yes, sir. As long as the supply key is with me, no man shall touch that medicine. May plague and calamity strike them all. Bloody idiot. What? Pirates! The ship's here! Pirates! Fall back to the mansion!
He has returned, Captain! What's the take? Two grates. And the means for mixing additional doses. That's uh, right thinking. Precious little of that these days. You hear that, Mr. Rax? My young friend returns with offerings and so saves your scrawny neck. Will you not thank him? You should quit these waters, Thatch. The governor, he's bound to muster more soldiers. Now you go on ahead. I, I got some business in the north. You're done, aren't you? Giving up on us. On NASA. Look, lad. I'm late into my fourth decade on this earth. And if I don't find some means to make the fifth quiet, and cozy voyage. I'd rather sink to the devil's doorstep than call myself captain another year. How we'll we meet again, lad. In this world. Or the one below. Are you ready? He's waiting for us. I just watched some of your footage from this week. It's amazing. Blackbeard was mental. And we all got so excited that we started talking about this idea for a trailer about him. Maybe start with him drinking, talking to some pirates, telling a story. Then, we cut to him leaping across the deck of his boat and... Sorry, his ship, not boat. But jumping around the deck of his ship, swinging from ropes, and fighting like a devil. I mean, obviously, we're gonna have to manipulate some of the existing footage to get it looking good, but it could be great. I'm getting a shiver in my timbers just thinking about it. <laughs> Sorry. says. 
Focus on the observatory. Assassin, Templars, crazy talk. I'm curious about this shareholders meeting, though. How about you break into Olivier's office and see if you can find his schedule? Oh, what? You don't like that idea? Well, how about I blow the fucking whistle on you, hacker? I own you! <laughs> what I mean is, I don't want to ruin your life, so do as I say. Now, step over to the window. You can't waltz into Olivier's office through the front door, so I've opened another route. Up we go. Did he know that Abstergo was run by Templars? Oh, yeah. Sounds like crackpot stuff, I know. But then again, the moon landing was fake, right? So, anything's possible. All right. Either you walk through that door, or throw yourself off the ta- Oh, well done, kiddo. Find his computer. Be careful now. As the data moves, there are security programs constantly monitoring the data flow. You need to sneak past them, or they will destroy your data and send it back home. You sneaky bastard. A pirate through and through, ain't you? Now. Get down to the lobby. There's a courier waiting. Yeah, that's right. I've been planning this for a few hours. Now, wait. The receptionist. Hold on. I'll try something. As gullible as ever. Now, hurry down to the lobby before I remotely detonate your earpiece. <laughs> Don't even think about ratting me out. My tracks are covered. Yours ain't. Did you, uh, like the allonge? I practiced. I think you pulled it a little too long. Oh, come on! It's not encrypted code, for God's sakes. It's just a bloody coffee. Oh, hooray! It's our old friend. Hey there! I just got a call about picking up another transfer. Oh? You said you were here to see me. Yes, that is one of the perks. Let's see it. Hmm. A conference in Chicago. Very nice. Thanks for this. We'll be in touch. Go, Rebecca. Text me. Stuff it, Hastings. I've an awful feeling about this. You'll be hurt out there. I couldn't handle that. I'll be careful, I promise. And when I'm flush with coin and set up, I'll send for you. I will. Caroline, come away! Don't exert yourself! I can't promise I'll come, Edward. If you leave on this fool's errand, I, I cannot promise anything. Don't give up on me, Caroline! Not when I need your faith the most. George has grown tired of our shenanigans. Who's the grim fella? That's Captain Woods Rogers. Not a man I want seeing my face. 
We desire a parley with the men who call themselves governors of this island. Charles Vane, Ben Hornigold, and Ed Thatch. Come forth, if you please. Hear about the King's pardon, I reckon. What the hell is Hornigold doing? <sighs> really living... Punk! What are you men up to? I am grateful for your geniality, Captain. <laughs> I assumed our reception would be a troubled one. Don't mistake my decorum for deference, Governor. I'm eager to hear what you have to say. But I've uncertain in mind otherwise. Very well. It's a fairer shake than I expected to see from any pirate. But I promise fair treatment to all who hear me out. Only wait a while longer, Governor Rogers. These rascals will show their true colors in time. Now, Commodore Chamberlain, I have given Captain Hornigold my word that we will be equitable. Won't do you a look of good. Men like him are a flight from his majesty's reputation. A peculiar town as if it were your own. Aye, but the king has been particularly ineffective in bringing about this change, hasn't he? And has failed at all attempts until now. Careful how you talk about his majesty, governor. You're here at his pleasure. I have my methods, Commodore, and I expect you to honor them to the letter. <clears throat> is our best and most efficient weapon. Twaddle, Governor! We should sink every goddamn ship not flying the King's colors. To do otherwise protects a certain weakness in our bearing. Silence, Commodore! I am the goddamn Governor here, serving at the King's pleasure, and I will make the bloody decisions. Is that clear, sir? Aye, sir. Your wishes are clear as crystal. Rogers believes he can make men of these monkeys yet. I do not. Return to your post and await my orders.
Well, this is kind of scuffed. Let's try again. But yeah, I lost like a minute at least. Happen. I'm losing time. That's what's happening. Okay, turn around. I'm not gonna risk it this time. Yeah, I lost. I think a minute, minute and a half here. Should have reloaded immediately. I screwed up my timings. Okay, finally, holy shit. Yeah, it's huge tamos. Sadly, sadly, huge tamos. Yeah, I can still save time. Yeah, I should have waited. Like, pattern was different. Oh, yeah, it's right. So yeah, I think uh, I minute I will lose a minute. Cost, and accept the king's Maybe a minute and as 15 seconds. For until such time, all of you will be confined in the south. I am sorry for this. But in lieu of a public trial, this pardon is your best bet. The governor puts it far too brightly, maggots. Take this message home. Accept the king's protection forthwith, or we will raise this town to its foundation and stretch your bloody necks. Peace. Commodore Chamberlain, we are messengers, not executioners. Not yet. Oh, thank you, sir. God save you. Look on this as a stroke of fortune, lads. We should take the king's pardon and salvage what dignity we Peace. own. I'll be hanged before I surrender to that bobbin. Check your head, Vane. We had here a rare opportunity, a chance to take something base and shape it into a government made and maintained by men of vision. But in two years, we pissed it away. I won't make that mistake again. It's truth is telling, and you whelps can't handle it. But you, you folks all headed fuddlers. See you at the gallows. You'll all be dead, men! Bastards! 
I need a drink. times I've put up with Horny Gold and his self-righteous shite. Verily, you are a man of principle, Captain Horny Gold. A man I believe I can trust with my best ideas. Faith and we'll survive this, Charles, with our pride intact. Well, that's confidence. You brewed a plan I might get a taste of? NASA is over, that's plain to see. I say we skip out tonight and regroup at my compound. Fair enough, what's your angle? The Brits have brought their supplies ashore, see? If we nick some gunpowder and pine pitch, we can build a fire ship and send it straight at the blockade, blasting it to smithereens. Aye. We'll use Rackham's ship. And a capable captain. My conscience is clear. Right. When you get the gunpowder, I'll secure the pine pitch.
Russians uh, well how do you see with the with the old mechanics like from all the games it's it's fine it looks fine yeah most likely I will be playing it like 99% Uh, yeah, it's basically Valhalla, but you can do like... Uh, can you do small bombs in Valhalla? I don't know. Maybe you can actually. Never used anything in Valhalla. Combat looks like in Valhalla. Parkour is like in Valhalla. 
And the rest looks like uh, be also like in Valhalla, but also like in all the games. City. Stand where you are. New city. Oh, boys, you're lagging. This is uh, camp. New story. Things like that. Right, the Commodore fears a revolt is nigh. His orders are to sink every goddamn pirate ship now anchored in that harbor tonight. It's about the governor's wishes, sir. This is a direct order, soldier. You will take position on the grounded galleon and await the Commodore's further orders. Is that clear? Aye, sir. No, like, uh, the war wasn't Assassin's Creed for, for three years already. When Valhalla came out, like in 2020, I think. So, yeah. Actually, a lot of people want to play it because it wasn't a new game for a long time. So I think it will do good, but if it won't do good, then yeah, all that stuff with the old Assassin's Creed is dead. Because all those people who say we want old Assassin's Creed don't actually play <laughs> when, when they actually make a game like that. They didn't play Unity. And. Yeah, we may not play Mirage as well. See, already someone is complaining. That's why we did it actually like this. Because last time we spent a ton of money on Unity, nobody actually played it. And saying that it didn't work on consoles when they patched it, uh, is it not? Is it still not working on consoles? Like, people play Cyberpunk, right? And that game was definitely worse on consoles than Unity. <laughs> Just kind of shows that all those people who whine on the internet that want all the Assassin's Creed actually don't want any Assassin's Creed. It sells better than ever. People say a lot of things about Ubisoft games. It's just how it is. Like, They remade Assassin's Creed 2. They just did it on cheap. Ah, remake? Ah, uh, no, they didn't. I don't think they will do remake of Assassin's Creed 2. But yeah, maybe they will. Yeah, they did remaster. Assassin's Creed 1 never happened. Never happened. Maybe it's DLC for Mirage. Only in this way.
What are we waiting for? Oh, let's screw this up. The sequence. Yeah, the sequence is kind of bad. I really need to go closer. Mm -hmm. Finally. Oh. Yeah, we'll stand here as well. It's fine, I guess. Oh yeah, we just wanted to try the old school. I don't think we believe actually. Well, basically, we want to make money. At the beginning, we wanted just to do old school DLC, even more old school than Valhalla. Even Valhalla is already old school enough. Decent. At least I got the rip skip. So yeah. Then I decided let's make money. Uh, we do a separate game. But we sell it on cheap, we make it small. And we try to actually... Uh, See if actually people want it, or we just say they want it. It's funny when Mirage will have daily missions. Like, last three games, they have a lot of escort missions. Yeah, like Origins has like a ton of all of this guy around. But yeah, but not any missions. And Mirage will have it because it's an old Assassin's Creed. <laughs> Nothing similar between Mirage and, <laughs> and Assassin's Creed 1. Like, <laughs> zero similarities actually. Soft reboot of uh, Assassin's Creed 1 was uh, uh, Unity. Yeah, Mirage is not that. My blood brother, we work together. And those were not Templars that you killed, they were my workers. Don't blame me. Your brother ordered it. Does he mean to use it? Me? I don't know, mate. I'm only after it. Hello, guy. Who good luck, everyone. Thanks for good luck. Hello, own cheetah gut. Thanks for good luck. I need you to tell me everything. And why should I trust you? Meet me at the bureau, and I will show you. Oh, bother. Well, it's supposed to be like a smaller game, so it will have a smaller map. It's kinda... ...a feature, again. People are just excited to, with the map small. 
even though like a ton of people played Valhalla. <laughs> it's like playing, I don't know, uh, Baldur's Gate or... Uh, or Starfield or any like Bethesda game. You don't just play it in one go. Well, I guess previously you can like complete Assassin's Creed in a week, maybe. Very relaxed time. Well, again, you're just not a uh, Bethesda audience. Which is sure a lot of people really satisfied, like a lot of people really satisfied with playing Assassin's Creed. Even though like Assassin's Creed is bad and all that stuff. I was saying ways of Starfield. It's just a certain formula that works for decent amount of people. Just not for you. No. That's okay. I'm sure plenty of people who are actually playing it. What is online on Steam right now? Three, three, three hundred thousand people. That's a lot. Oh, Shakul, thanks for good luck. to us look there don't let them sink our fire ship that's our ace I think it depends on the person. No, there shouldn't be like visible differences. Although we patched uh, something on Steam recently and they broke the game and now you cannot buy it on Steam. Because I removed it after they broke it. There's some new patch. Alright, all is spawn. Oh. Yeah, we just sit and learn. I don't know how long it will take for you. Yeah, again, I'm too fast here. This mystery mission is a, a weird recently. Like, look how slow this guy is. I'm supposed to be like another wave spawn here, but because uh, he's so slow. Yeah, nothing spawned really. Oh, whatever. Still should be better because I completed. 
no objective. Mighty mess there. <laughs> Burn your bastards! Yeah! The burning of your ass, governor! Prancing about like they took a prize. Oh, wow, I even saved time. Awesome. I guess it's save time. No, I lost like one second, two seconds. Yeah. Oh, hi, kid. You missed quite a time. Aye. Pity about Nassau and Blackbeard flying the coop. Well, we'll see about Thatch. Vane's off to see him now, and I'm following soon. This is what's left of your experiment in democracy. Aye. We do as we please here, and we take our time doing it. But for Christ's sake, Edward. Don't anything but the stink of riches wrinkle your nose. What's got into you, man? Reality, mate. Reality. See that you ain't pulled into the drink by this drowning rat. Oi! I've lived longer than most men who trod this path. My lovesick idiot of a brother has misled me. Start from the start, mate. Recently, our trade introduced us to a formidable woman, Jing Lang, a pirate from the farther seas of the Orient. Intriguing. She and Vance quickly became inseparable. For any reason, he should have thought your men were spies. Well, there is the treasure. Oh? A pirate sold us a map. We each kept half. Come. I will meet him now. If you follow with discretion, you may hear it for yourself. Follow me at a distance. If anyone sees you, tell them you are my bodyguard. There are thieves about who would stop at nothing to secure either half. Now tell me, you brought it. It? 
My half of the map, you mean? The map. The map. Of course, the map. The map to the treasure, to our legacy. That very one. I have mine. Where is yours? Vance, you know I feel we must protect that treasure with utmost caution. On the contrary. That map is our protection. Its treasure are for you. All the more reason to keep it buried. Well, have you no imagination? Can you not imagine the luxurious life that awaits us once we emerge its bounty? I really don't think it would. Travers estate plantations. No more struggle. No more than I Question her love, her fitness. Of course not. But knowing her as you do, you must appreciate that she is a woman of action. She needs to see her challenge. How will she adapt to a quiet domestic life? Jing is none of your concern. Vance, do you intend to marry her? Of course. It pains me to tell you, but I do not believe she is Oh, you give you such insight into her heart. What are you talking about? What kind of percent? No, I think it will be like... Uh... I have no oh. It'll be like uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 is done. Redemption 2 100% is done in segments, it's just some rules on segments, I think you cannot have more than certain amount or there should be at least certain length, but yeah I think Odyssey and Valhalla will be like that, because yeah, I don't think it will be as fast as 24 hours, especially Odyssey. I just saved your life, mate. Vance. He said he would kill me. I thought it was bluster. He is my brother. Despite what you told me, I thought it meant something. You're safe for now. But perhaps a trip away from Nassau would do you some good. Let's 
go. No! Not over there. ABC. Church, sir. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy... Mate, the Father, the Son, and the Holy... What's the third one again? Let's just keep it moving, yeah? The Father, the Son, and the... Let's keep it moving? No, that's not it. What does it matter? <laughs> it doesn't. It doesn't matter. Nothing in this sour life does. Let's keep it moving. Keep it moving. That's it. Who the hell are you? It's all right, Mick. Help me not be like a child. You just need the drink to wear off. Are you safe here? Safety is an illusion. But yes, I have friends here I can hide. Good. What do you must think of me? Have I said anything embarrassing? No, mate. You sound quite the scholar. Betrayal makes one feel softer than ever. I doubt it'll come to that. I'm so afraid for him. But please help keep him safe. Sober up, mate. We'll finish this in the morning. You're a forever friend, right? Hmm. Jin Lang, as I live it. Imagine the Queen of Pirates, Jin Lang, defeated for a fake map. I have been arrogant. Really? Yes, I stole the real one, both halves. My husband has it. Your husband? Better man than these fools.
Also, a lot of people like this game. Like Assassin's Creed 2, Assassin's Creed 4, and Origins uh, 3 best received Assassin's Creed, at least on the internet. Usually, there is a really positive sentiment. How Origins managed it, I have no idea. It's magic. But yeah, it did, it did. Just I guess sometimes uh, people don't want to hate anymore. Captain has been up. Well now, me boys, we are bound out to sea. 
A windward Caroline come down to me. She's lovely, you know, and she's lovely, but no. And she's best on her back as you marry her. For the men, with those gallants. You're not some cloak twitching. My dear fellow, can I help you? I can even tell you all the tales your mama did for a fee. Anything that moves. There was a deserter among them who recalled my face. I slice it with gullet or any word left in his lips. Anybody see it? Don't think so, sir. But I reckon Kenway suspects something. He don't miss much. Tell me about the beach. A fair gathering, sir. Most too drunk to stand. That will suit our purpose. Tell me about Edward. What sort of man is he? It's Thatch, sir. At least that's what he calls himself. But he's a mad bugger, he is. Cracked as a glass teapot, sir. Details, man. Stop talking in gibberish. Well, sir, he likes his drink. Only he makes them queer. Takes a usual rum flip and fills it with half a weight of gunpowder to top it off. Did I hear you were right? He drinks gunpowder? Aye, sir. Just for show. And only last week, he rounded up a score of his crew and bade a sickly old of his ship while he burnt off sulfur and other sickening minerals. We just sat there like it was one of a million pits of hell and nothing less ordinary. Good God! What the hell for? Like to test his crew is all. Tease out their fitness and what. Of course, it always turned out he was the fittest of the lot. Thought for a moment I'd die there. Bloody savages. Have no fear, soldier. This will be the end of them. Come on. It's time. Quickly, send the signal. And remember always this day. What the devil?
are they? What a fat sir. Did he fall? Captain? He drinks damnation. Well, his friend died. <laughs> That's why it's sad. Ready to fire, sir! Ah! 
¡Alto! ¡Pronto estarás criando malvas! I'll uh, appear later. Yeah, again, don't have enough uh, loot. Here. That's fine.
some wind. Captain has the helm. Hey boys! How don't you see? Captain has the Get the base! No, there's a lot of iron and so it looks the same. Oh, actually, I think uh, different by differences are very small. And not small. for slave ships. Any that work for the Royal African Company. You don't mean to traffic human cargo. No, Jesus. We don't need better than that. Only our information. The princess. The slave ship. Right. Blackbeard told me there's a good chance we find a sage of it. Captain, Ben's just sunk a merchant spooner. Damn, can't that animal stay the course we agreed to? Get us in close. Enemy make it! Awaiting order! Fire! Ready to fire, sir! 
Damn that Captain Vin! He's unloading everything he has! He'll sink it if he's not careful. Get close. Chase those bastards down, Kenway. I'll murder the men who stole my ship. Keep calm, mate. Remember what we're after. If we time it right, we can use our force to our advantage. Guns and steel aren't louder than sticks. Spittle, babe. I've more than enough of all that. Just find the captain. Captain claims the princess sails out of Kingston every few months. All right. We'll say a course. You made ash of my sails and rigging, jackanapes. You owe me a share. Oh! Oh, damn it, Vane! Oh, Charles. Yeah. What a surly devil you are. Don't fuck with me, Jack. Oh, but it's my mandate to fuck with you, Charles. Oh. Lads? Ah, see, oh. the boys and I had a bit of counsel while you were wasting time with this slot. And, um, well, they figured I'd be a fitter captain than you reckless dogs. I'll cut you another cut, Tracer! <laughs> this one I figure I might sell for a tenner down in Kingston, but uh, with you two grog blossoms, I can't take any chances. You regret this day, Rackham. I regret most of them already. Tie them up! Cast them off. I'll gut you, Jack Rackham! I'll open you up! I'll tear out your organs and string your bloody loot with them! Stop your goddamn howling, Vane! There's no bloody use! Well, well. The face of our good Kenway speaks, eh? Pray tell us, Captain, how to quit this predicament. And tell us what genius you have for sailing a boat with no sails and no rudder. Shut your gob!
Dance with the fishermen and their dories, Kenway! This island's mine! Come at me and I'll cap you, bastard! It was your bloody imagination that landed us here, Kenway! I'll be damned if I let that mine make one more decision for me! Will you not talk to me, Vane? Are you fixed on this madness? Madness? <laughs> Nothing bad about that fighting to survive, is there? I mean you no harm, you corker! Now let's work this out like gentlemen. Oh, God! I've got a bleeding headache on account of your jabbering! Now stay back and let me live in peace! I would if you stop filching the food I gather. I'll stop nothing till you pay me back in blood. You was the reason we were out looking for slavers, and you was the reason Jack Rackham took my crew! Ahora machine, ahí solo que va. You and your bloody fairy stories got into this mess, Kenway. And I'll be damned if I let you You keep this up, and I'll have to kill you, Vane! Bloody try! It's either you or me who's leaving this island alive, Welcher! 
because I'm not going to say it again in a world cursed by your ugly boat. Aye, another keystone. Bloody rags will be all that's left of you, can't we? Not dead yet! Here! Nancy boy, you only done half a fucking job. Fucking hell. Is this my reward for believing the best about men? For thinking that a bilge rat like you could muster up some fucking sense once in a while? Maybe Horner Gold was right. Maybe the world does need men of ambition to stop the likes of you from mucking it all up. <laughs> or maybe. You just don't have the stones to live with no regrets. <laughs> don't save me a spot in hell, Shanka. I ain't coming soon. No, I haven't routed it yet. Maybe at the end of this month or... At the end of next month.
much sail as you can! Close down! Close the gallants and war!
Captain has the So handy, me boy, so handy. Why can't she be so handy? Oh, handy, me boy, so handy. Oh, a full of this yard must go. Handy, me boy, so handy. Oh, a full of from down below. Handy, me boy, so handy. Ah, uh, growl ye may, but go ye must. Who's up? He's her so sex. Any percent is six hours. If you want this game, there's also DLCs. DLCs are short, like Avelin DLC is 15 minutes. Uh, Freedom Cry is one hour. Not really one I deacon. <laughs> well, I guess it has two runners <laughs> instead of one or zero. <laughs> yeah, in that regard, yeah. This is most popular. This one is not very good. Overall. Hello, hello. Come here. Where are you? Come on. Now she's running away. What is going on right now? I need to shoot you. Wow, this is so dumb. Finally. The white jaguar. A fine catch. You have more than proven yourself. We accept your help. With what? Look. Frigate. Why? Is there anything out there but fish? No. Those are your Templars. You have a ship and a pale face, vessel and passport. 
We're not really any big glitches in this, in this game. Even legendary ships is an intended mechanic. It's like no nothing glitchy about legendary ships. Oh, there are only bad glitches in this game. Like... Ships spawning underwater, things like that. There are some small ones, like you can interrupt some animations with uh, throwing money and um, small bombs. But it's like... It's not very serious glitch. Doesn't save that much time. Opia, and how are we today? Surprised. No, it's different. I don't. All of these are different. You just don't see the difference because it's very, very small. Irresistible attraction to Templars. If that is who bought these ships. Well, not really. I need uh, 700 more floors. And yeah, it takes me a year to take uh, to get a thousand floors. So it's not that. Not that soon. This game was a good game to farm powers on, but even that doesn't work anymore. I made a break and now I don't get my, my 300 viewers. To get a lot of followers during the run. Well, I guess in speed running terms, yeah, here is not that long. You see, Alvin is practically nobility now. <laughs> A noble fisherman, indeed. Oh, actually, he's not dead after that. <laughs> but yeah. There's some MMA animations for hand to hand combat in Assassin's Creed in American Trilogy. Which is pretty funny. And he does this when. Uh, Corner does a suplex, how how it is called, like throwing the guy over himself. The bill of sale we stole gives the address of a man in her employ. 
a Thargus. I saw. I know where it is. Let's pay the bait boy a visit. Find out what he knows. Follow us. You must try to understand what it is at stake. I've got some idea. No, it's more than your key. There are those who say the Taino are already extinct. We will never be extinguished. Our fight continues. I'm showing in Caribbean it's warm whole Here year. It is. And you can swing as long as you like. Hola! State your business! I hope for an audience with Senorita Marquez. with it, lad. Where's Marquez? Why is she here? She's already left for Juvel Jude. Find her there if you must. Her army will teach you a lesson. Who went to this island of our enemies? If Lucia Marquez has gone there, it is certain we are her How many enemies do you have? When you're hunted, it sometimes seems that every stranger is an enemy. On Juventud, we have been a truce since the death of the first Marcus, but this woman could reignite our dispute if her price is high enough. Ah, can't have that. I take this ship. Meet me there if you still want your key. ¿Qué puedo hacer hoy por usted? Fire! Take a shot! Right there, sir! 
enemy making for us, sir. Fire! It's a brig. Spanish Enzoi. Fire! Seems to be alone, sir. Fire! Get up there, sir. That'll wipe him out. Fire! Brace yourself. We're ready to hit him, sir. Fire! Give me some... Captain's trip. Get the mate!
I am. Well, I was running Watch Dogs to. I was running a bunch of uh, uh, non Assassin's Creed games, but yeah, now I don't even have time for Assassin's Creed games. So I guess this is the priority. For now, at least. I wish I could I have more time and I can run a bunch of other stuff. Yeah, also Watch Dogs 1 is just like the best Watch Dogs run and it's crazy run. So much, so, so much stuff, so much tech in that run. It's awesome. That run is awesome. In terms of like how good the runs are, I think the first game and the second game when the, when the Legion. How interesting, I guess. But yeah, uh, first one is much more interesting. Tons of speed run. Another two. Well, some Assassin's Creed are shorter than that. For example. I don't know about Rogue, but Unity definitely any percent shorter. Oh, and the shortest game any percent is Odyssey. It's crazy fast. The fastest run by far, at least New Game Plus.
Alright, cool. From where will it me will it restart me? From beginning? No, not from beginning, nice. Okay. Well, that's not a big time loss. She must be hiding. Let's take some action she can't ignore. I cannot die at the ends of the Taino. My father saw such potential in this islands. Gold. Industry. Freedom. All of it squandered. You have not a clue how to use it. He could have brought you wealth. Do you believe we wasted freedom of being free? You die a prisoner of your Templar moors. Let's not argue with a dead woman. Here's my prize. Another keystone. <clears throat> this is more like it. <clears throat>
One more for the collection.
I'm ahead by half an hour. A little bit more than half an hour, like 31, 32 minutes. Necesita ayuda, caballero.
Get the meat!
Gentle Mario, yes. My son is already fetching hours long, around more, a little bit more than fetching hours. So yeah, I have uh, how much? Three and a half hours to go, and I'll be done. Spawn, really bad. Right, can I actually avoid them? Okay, think I did. Yeah, that was not very good. RNG. Ghost the gallants and royal. Hold down. Yes, single stream. Well, not that much time left to complete.
What news are they? Hold a moment. Stop the bastard! Help! You! Stop! Ha. You won't take us that way! Have you alerted the men? We're short on time. Aye. There'll be two soldiers waiting for us at the crossroads. Very good. If you don't mind me asking, sir, what's the meaning behind this blood sandwich? Torres tells me that blood is required for the observatory to properly function. In How other words, a small sample of blood gives us access to a man's everyday life. In other words, a small sample of blood gives us access to a man's everyday life. Does Torres mean to spy on me then? Bribes has given him a sample of my blood. As have I, Captain Hornigold. As will all Templars. It is a measure of insurance. Trust. Yes, but fear not. Torres has shipped our samples to a Templar safe house in Rio de Janeiro. And we will not be the observatory's first subjects, I assure you. It will appear later. I suppose it's a small price to pay for what the Templars have given me in return. Precisely. Governor, when you hunted, I offered those pirates. Take a part and return to England penniless for three men. Oh, this is so sketchy. Should be good though. Should I buy stuff? Oh, I don't think so. Yeah, this is very sketchy. Yeah, we'll lose time here. Another world though. I think Oh, 
Grandmaster, welcome. Buenas noches. What have you learned? The princess was taken by pirates six weeks ago. And so far as we know, the sage Roberts was still aboard. Very good. It is something wrong. And what measures are you taking to recover the princess from these pirates? Captain Hornigold has dispatched some of his best men to ensure the sage is captured. Mm -hmm. What of the sage's present location? Africa, Your Excellency. Africa? My God. I, to I concur, Grandmaster. I should have sailed there myself. One of my slave galleys would be more than capable of making a swift journey. Slave galley? Captain, I ask you to divest yourself of that sick institution. I fail to see the difference between enslaving some men and all men. Our aim is to steer the entire course of civilization. Body and slave inspires the mind to the world. But the flavor A fair point, Grandmaster. Hello, Carol. It's going good. Thanks for the good luck.
for the rock. Good days hunting.
can't be legal. I can keep the heat off. For a fee. Thank <laughs> you. 
left in peace, my friend. using any cheats no cheat is enabled right now no cheats this run 
This run is clean. I don't have favorite Assassin's Creed. Oh, you're all the same to me. Oh wow, well, I forgot one chest. What? Ah, he's down there. Okay. Good thing I noticed. Yeah, this is a time loss, but not that big. like 30 seconds maybe here Wow, look at the experts. Crazy. Look at the expert in chat.
Take a mark! Call in the stun stuff! Loose all and trim sharp to the wing! Concentrate on the task at hand, sir! Fire! <laughs> Douse all but me! Fire! Look at it! Put your right in there! Fire! That's a good shot, Concrepa! Incoming fire! 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 Awaiting order, Fire! sir! Fire! Found of the ship, Kenwick! All these guys is a retard. Well, nobody asks your opinion, you know that, right? That's my point. Nobody cares what you think. Oh wow. That's bad. Oh! 
Три часа. Put some muscle in that bustle, or we're leaving you behind. <laughs> you done us good, Kenway. Proved yourself a true bravo. And for what? His own bloody pride. You stepped in the path of my prize. Not a thing a man should do. <laughs> <laughs> a cocksure, Cully? Just like Harlick all said. That Templar scab means nothing to me. None of you do. And you're worse for it, Kenway. It were the Templars who took us in when all else went to shit. Not our king. Not our country. The Templars. The Templars is our family. Where's yours? <clears throat> Service. There are thin columns. No wages found. Yet, as gentlemen of fortune, we enjoy plenty and satisfaction, pleasure and ease, liberty and power. So, what man with a sensible mind would choose the former life when the only out of reach pirates run is a sour look from those without strength or splendor? <laughs> now, I have been among you six weeks, and in that time, I have adopted your outlook as my own, and with so fierce a conviction that it may frighten you to see your passions reflected from me in so stark a light. But if it's a captain you see in me now, I then I'll be a bloody captain. Ah! For I have dipped my hands in muddied waters, and, withdrawing them, find it better to be a commander than a common man! Yeah! Oh. Yeah! You me with your assistance. I'm looking for the observatory. Folks say you're the only man that can find it. Folks are correct. Despite my distaste for your eagerness, I see in you a touch of untested genius. I'm Bartholomew Roberts. Edward. I have no secrets to share with you now. But if you'll lend me your aid, in two months' time, west of the Leeward Islands, well, it's there you'll get some answers, I promise you. Funny that. 
With scurvy, the fix is more pleasant than the cause. When you catch a dose from a horn, must treat it with quicksilver. You're fonder of getting the disease than you are of curing it. Something biting at you. Oh, all men desire to live by a code or a creed, yes? Yet when pressed, most place. defer to their instincts Less than three hours. rather than the laws that bind them. Like. What is the appeal of a creed if it does not yoke all men to like behavior? I don't know. Might make a man feel like 250. He belongs to something. What's your answer? Oh, something. All men are sheep. And an old wolf like me deserves every ounce of blood he draws. Sail to this location. Bring only those you trust. This is more like it. <laughs> Ah, another Mayan keystone.
Ah, another Mayan keystone. Loose and catch the wind! Get those bars free! Let's see that dock! Yeah, to the starboard! Come, boy! Slow and heavy cut! As much sail as you can! Exactly right. I see that it should have a placard placed at its borders. Welcome to Kasluit Bar, the town you are. From Swansea myself. Ah, a teeming metropolis. There's the thing. Scallywag gives us away. I'll paint the water deck with it. Got the flag. Aye. I went I'll keep my distance. Low and steady. Aye. Flag we stole. Por favor, senhor. Implore que considere aquilo que está prestes a fazer. Now he was even. What's he whinging about? He's no He's a static. Squad police mission. I'll keep my distance. Slow I, and steady. I, I will go I slow here. Yeah, whatever. Let's just go slow. Come off the wind or something. Hey, hey! A key shot to die! Not where a ship right with pain. They'll not come near then. Let's get the catch them again. Let's go. 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 
Ouvi uma história sobre um espanhol que veio visitar o nosso almirante. Where's our Portuguese captain? Yeah, so far this mission doesn't go that well. Not seeing a lot of time here. Well, it shouldn't be worse than my PB though. desta e também não estão a yeah I'm not saving anything on this awesome yeah I could have saved like up to four minutes here yeah last time last time it was better anyway this is what I do is let's try again I just played bad. I just played really badly. Mm. Yeah, shame.
Here's my prize. Ah, the Templars have been busy, I see. Lawrence Prince's blood. Useless now. Woods Rogers, Ben Hornigold, even Torres himself. Small quantities kept for a special purpose. You must take me to the observatory, Roberts. I need to know what it is. To what end, eh? Will you sell it from under my nose? Or work with me and use it to bolster our game? Whatever improves my lot in life. How ridiculous. A merry life and a short one, that's my motto. It's all the optimism I can muster. All right, Captain Kenway. You've earned a look. Right, maybe I want to save some time, I don't know. Uh, yeah, maybe B is really bad. <laughs> maybe even, even this is better. Yeah, I lose a lot of time here. But yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, of course, he's a great guy. Don't you see? Awesome guy. Bye, Meta G. Thanks for the good luck. Привет, не скажу. Это не важно.
Well, nobody checked. You can be the first. Check, maybe you find find different language. And one Most more likely, stone. it doesn't matter. What language? Maybe in some rare occasion. But overall, it shouldn't matter in this game. Yeah, nobody checked. So if you're willing to do that work, that would be great. Nobody else is willing to. Когда сделал раунд? Раунд сделал в течение месяца. It's Ben Hornigold, come to kill us out there. Aye, and the traitor needs to die. But what then? Can you say with certainty that you deserve the observatory more than he and his Templars? No, I can't, and I don't care to try. But if you've a better idea, by all means, tell me. Forget walking with robots. Tell the assassins. Bring them here, and let them protect this place. Stop. 
and one more stone. back there, lads. And if we live out this day, by God, I'm playing every last bitch of you. <clears throat> Steady up. Keep your backs together, lads. This fight ain't over. Oh, you won't lose us. They're already dead. <laughs> can do. He'll be after me, sure as I'm standing here. Hold your ground and be ready. on the wing.
Soon you will know. Next split is the real split. Just wait a little bit. Half a minute, maybe. Well, not by much. For most time, I saved the chest. Four minutes or something. Yeah, could have been much better, but a lot of mistakes. A lot of mistakes. I will not be Assassin's Creed a good game. All Assassin's Creed games are good. Cool games. They are also often quite boring and have a lot of repetitive content.
Lad will put up a fight, Edward. Are you willing to push back if necessary? Huh? To kill if you will. Close. My awesome start. Why did I do that? Oh, because I switched. Anyway, this is like I don't know, 20 seconds lost. But yeah, I need to be careful on this mission.
Aquí, Mil. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, damn. Yeah, I'm losing time here. A lot of time. Anyway. Time number two. No, oh, it's like in, if you're in certain position, they will like shoot constantly. Oh, can I jump over? Yeah, I can jump. I can jump over there. Yeah. Okay, great. This is so scuffed, crazy scuffed. Yeah, I lost a lot of time here. Anyway. Hopefully, I complete it. Did I complete? Yes, I did. Nice. At least this I completed the optional this. objective. Run is alive. 
anyway. Yeah, I was more than a minute. Roberts, have you gone mad? Quite the contrary, Edward. These wags would have gone mad at seeing what lies beyond this gate. But you... I suspect you're made of sterner stuff. Now, pick up that chest and carry it hither. Dirty and decrepit. Not quite as I remember, but it has been over 80 millennia. Ah, rot. That's impossible. Step as if on thin ice, Captain. I must say I'm quite taken by this new vocation of mine. And it may amuse you to know that I have authored my own articles of conduct. A creed of your own, eh? To keep the peace, yes. I forbid all gambling upon the deck, for instance, for it leads to more conflict than camaraderie. Desertion during battle is forbidden. And I require that all men keep their pieces and cutlasses clean and fit for service at all times. Look at this place. Beautiful, isn't it? Aye. It's like something out of a fairy tale, or one of them old poems. There were many stories about this place once. Tales that turned into rules and again into legend, the inevitable process of facts becoming fiction before fading away in time. More blood vials? Yes. These cubes contain the blood of an old and ancient people. A wonderful race in their time. The more you talk, man, the less I understand. I don't expect you to. Only remember this. The blood in those vials is not worth it. again one day, but not in this. Here we are. What's that noise? Ah, oh, yes. A security measure. Just a moment. There we are. So what is this place? Think of it as a large spyglass, such as we sailors carry. A device capable of seeing great distances. <laughs> this is bloody witchcraft. No, this is Mr. Jack Rackham. Somewhere in the world at this moment. NASA? Well, this is happening right now. We're seeing through his eyes. Aye. A curious bunch. Let's try another. Governor Woods Rogers. You have a bold idea, but I must think it carefully.
Oh, your jackdaws flown, Edward. Eh? That's the beauty of a democracy. The many outvote the one. Oh, you could sail with me, but with a temper as hot as yours, I fear you'd burn us all to cinders. Luckily, I know the king's bounty on your head is a large one, and I intend to collect. Have you, uh, have you ever seen the inside of a Jamaican prison, boy? Since I have a record of each and every one of your hacks, 
We'll just search for the timestamps on those and turn that data into something harmless. Easy as that. <laughs> Here we are. Beautiful. I'll update your communicator one more time. A little program I cooked up just for this purpose. There we go. I think that worked. Try it out. Cipher. It's Walpole, ain't it? Walpole? Where'd you get that? Well, that's the rumor going round. As dirty and daft a pirate as ever sailed these West Indies. Well, whatever his name, gotta make sure he suffers without dying. Orders from the governor. And back to the prisons at sundown. Ah! Up. Oi! You stop that! Oi! Oi! You stop that! Hey! Oi! Open stop this that! Gibbet. Quiet, you! Good morning, Captain Kenway. I have a gift for you.
gonna be a friend looking out for him. You weren't much of a friend, Jack Rackham, nor an able sailor, neither. But you were strange and lively. And you made me laugh more than once. And that's enough. Don't you stop lightning! <laughs> in me sight. He's a friend. What's wrong with Mary? She's ill. And her child? They took her. No idea where. Oh! 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 I know it pains, my lady, but we must be silent. Can you walk? Oh! Oh! Lean on me, Mary. Come on. Search every cell! Come on, that's it. You're all right. Stop. Stop, please. I ain't leaving you, damn it. Oh. Lift your arm. No good. There's no one here. I ain't even you know him. Don't get out of your way. Put me down, Edward. You should have been the one to outlast me. I've done my part. Will you? If you came with me, I could. Mary. I'll be with you, can we? I will.
with self-harm. You there! What's happened with Mary? What's wrong? Is she gone? Nothing sensible. You haven't earned this, but... ...they suit you. Good fortune to you, Edward. See some color first. Will this do? In all your years out here, you could never achieve what I've done in one fifth the time. Because you're a good man, Edward, see? Goodness is your disease. That's my Get prize, Robert! I'll give it here! <laughs> Remember my creed, boy. A short life and a merry one, that is all. The world owes us nothing more than this. So take what you will, and then die before you live to see yourself made a fool. Ugh. Ugh. And slink back Thanks, to your right. Remember you duck. Thank you. Brand of madness. Robert! Welcome aboard, Kenway. It's prizes, plunder, and adventure ahead. Are you game? Out of my way, Ben. Raise a glass to freedom, lads. Here's to gentlemen of fortune and women of leisure. To a world full of rogues, better than all the kings and queens that kick us about. As gentlemen of fortune, we enjoy plenty and satisfaction, pleasure and ease, liberty and power. What man with a sensible mind would choose the former life? For I have dipped my hands in muddied waters, and, withdrawing them, find tis better to be a commander than a common man! high above a shepherd's field that swooped down on powerful wings a grazing lamb and carried off to her nest. Blind close by, a jackdaw saw the deed 
and it filled his head with the idea that he too was just as strong and capable. So, with a great flapping and rustling of feathers, the jackdaw came down swiftly. No more than two years! You promised me! You left! Well, I needed you the most! But you had me! What keeps you wondering? Do I not make you happy? I'm so close, Caroline! Please! Just let me do this! Is everything you do out spy, Edward? It's not spite that's driving me, Mary! It's courage! Courage for what, man? There's no one left in your life to care! God damn you all! I can handle this! Lout! Always tearing down when you could be building things up, or building yourself up, if nothing else! Just leave me be! Change course, Edward! Change your bloody course before it's too late! ¿En qué puedo ayudarlo hoy? Incoming fire! Fire! 
Disappeared, Captain. May I be of service? We 
to planks. Stand up. Let's get moving. Ground on every inch of Douse the royals at top. Might I be of assistance? Waiting orders! Break it down! Jeez! Look, Kevin! Put a shot right through there! Fire! Take a shot right there, sir! Let's go! 
Got him! Breaking up, jeez! Our Deputy merchant to... friend has earned himself some serious enemies. Aye, Captain. They seem rather committed to his capture. Christ, this reward had better be worth it. Grease the topsails and gallants! Armory Captain! Grease! Short North Dale! Fire! Yay! Stand up! Let's get moving! Mary was fond of you, Edward. She saw something in your bearing that gave her hope you might one day fight with us. Aye. She told me. And what do you think of our freedom? It's hard to say. For if nothing is true, then why believe anything? And if everything is permitted, why not chase every desire? Why, indeed. It might be that this idea is only the beginning of wisdom. Not its final form. That's quite a step up from the Edor I met here many years ago.
Find the men who led this attack. Finish him off. That coward is hiding aboard his ship. Yanumuk Awoyetel Abishan. And once more you have our thanks, Edward. You are welcome here. Thank you, sir. I'll rest here for a time before setting up, if I may. How's her child? She is a strong woman, but not invincible. Sorry for your loss. If I'd stayed in prison, they'd have taken him from me. He'd not be alive. Maybe this is God's way of saying I'm not fit to be a mother yet. Carrying on like I do. Cursing, drinking, and fighting. You are a fighter, I. In prison, I heard stories of the infamous Anne Bonny and. Mary Reed taking on the King's Navy together. Just the pair of you. It's all true. Anne would have won that day if Jack and his lads were and passed out in the hold from drink. I don't. Everyone's gone, aren't they? Mary, Raccoon, Touch, all the rest. them so rough as they were. Do you feel that too? All empty inside? I do. Devil curse me. <laughs> 